and here we are. Hello, ASDC. I still don't know how you want me to say your name. If you if you said it earlier and I missed it, I apologize. But hi, it's good to see you again. Uh, let me pull up. We want to do our checks like we do. There it is. We want to do our checks like we do at the beginning of every stream. You know, where we just want to real quick go through and go. Yeah. Let's see, Super Beer Bros, Ted editing, and Kadikaris playing Demon Souls. Oh, I want to play Demon Souls. I want to play Demon Souls. All right, left, left, right, right, up, up, down, down, right, left, left, right. Um, I, I don't really know a way to check with the sound. And pause, pause. There might be a little bit of a cycle, don't worry about it. Alright, dope! Got it. Yeah, I, I really want to play Demon's Souls. I have it on the PS3, but it was so clunky and painful. I want to play on the PS5, but I don't have PS5, because everywhere it's out of stock. Or there's scalpers on eBay, and fuck that, frankly. I'm not going to pay $1,000 for it. But also, Demon's Souls. Anyways, I think, I'm trying to remember my, oh yeah, that's right, I got it. okay, I got that, I got that. how much ammo do I got, okay, don't have the most, sh every time, don't have the most shotgun, but I do have a lot of handgun, which is good, except the problem is, last time we played this, I was basically told yeah, I was basically told that to get to avoid getting the absolute worst ending, I have to not kill like a hundred enemies and there's like three hundred total or something like that. So it's just try your best not to kill anything unless you have to. So it's a lot of me sitting here going like, God damn it. I'm actually genuinely good at killing things in this game. But let us let us begin. I think we're all good. I think we're all good to go, right? <gasps> Hello everyone, my name is Nexel Slow Extra. Welcome back to Silent Hill 3. On the last episode, we started this game and we immediately started using the you know, the 3D movement as opposed to like the tank movement or whatever you want to call it. And it's so freaking good. And what what did we what did we go through? We were stuck in a mall, and then we were stuck in a train station, and then we were stuck in, like, the sewers. We don't know what's going on, other than that we have memory lapses, and that we are an awesome character in comparison to others. Uh, please tell me if the game is too loud. It's a problem with this atmospheric style of whatever, you know what I mean? It also doesn't help that we purposefully got rid of the radio because you know if we're not gonna if we're gonna do our best to avoid killing things then we gotta do our best to avoid killing wait hold on was that a was that a map no I forgot Hey Max, quick reminder, this is a horror game. Just real quick reminder, this is a horror game. Wait, what? Third floor ceiling has crumbled. Man, this place is freaking tall. The fourth level floor has crumbled. Oh, this map can be messed with, yeah. I did not think I'd be able to do that. I 
forgot. I forgot this was a horror game. I forgot this was a horror game. I was in here for a happy Heather fun time. Okay. Looks like a bunch of hobos lived here. Looks like someone drunk lived here. Um something else I'm looking at. Sure. Like I, I I don't see a reason not to. Unless there's another reason I would use a mattress. Squatterism here, yeah, squatter rights. Okay. So, f so two is different too. It might break if it if it's hit hard enough. Okay, that didn't work. This was shot. What do I need to get? Like a small explosive or something? Yeah, I don't have a map of the area. Eck. Honestly, a map is probably on the first floor. That'd be the intelligent thing to do, would be to go down there, but... Woo! That wasn't that bad. Man, I am freaking adorable. Oh, the music started. Good shit. Oh. <laughs> what? Well. <gasps> the fuck? Where'd that guy come from? The fuck? Where'd he come from? gun. I have a gun. Don't make me use it. Um, the coffee machine? This place is very well... I don't see any of them might come in handy, though. Uh, for mannequin. Why was that room in particular all well made and nice and pretty? I'm like, I'm looking, am I looking at the door? I think I'm looking at the door, okay. Nope, um, nope, can't grab a defibrillator. Nope, okay. Nope, uh, okay. Someday when I get a map, this place is gonna be so well filled out, it's gonna be dope. Alright, that's right, I can't hit L1, R1, just turn around. Noted? I don't know about you guys, but for me, it's not really that dark. You know, so it's not like we have to...
I fucking hate it. I just want everyone to know in the room, I have a gun. Such a trap. Just want everyone to know for the record. That's not how mannequins work. That's not how mannequins are made. That's... <sighs> Good jump scare. Good jump scare. I don't have a map. I was about to be like, well, let's hit triangle to see where we are. It's like, I don't have a map. I don't have a good way to look around the corner. Shit. Is there really no way for me to walk a little quieter? My goodness, I have to stip stop. Alright, sounds crap. It's good to see you. And yeah, I just, I just, uh. uh my bad, my bad. In here. Ah! That's it. No, okay, nothing, 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 nothing. There's literally nothing in here but a chair. Fuck this. Oh, very good. Uh, it doesn't look like there's anything I'm interested in. I'm interested in. Dance. I'm so interested in dance. Ah, <gasps> uh, thank you, oh God. Thank you, God. All right, all right, all right okay. How how comprehensive is this shit? Hilltop Center. Oh, fuck, beaut. That room just had us a bunch of enemies. Oh, great, good. Yeah. Actually, speak up. Yeah, let's look, at the, let's look at the map real quick. Yeah, it's just an empty room full of it. Fuck. Okay. Okay. Huh? Oh, no. Is that a rope? Oh, uh, did someone hang themselves? Fuck. I don't got really a tool to pull open the... Huh. I'm just gonna, just gonna rub my head on this. I'm just gonna, just real quick, don't, don't mind me. I'm just, just gonna rub my head until it works. But yeah, how's, how's, how's it going? How are things? Okay, let's check the next door. Uh, it's a flyer for the dance. It's a pretty good dance, but I don't have time to appreciate it. I assume they mean the, the pinup girl. Oh. Oh, this is a jump scare. Ah! Here we go. I gotta come to the office to get it. Oh, good. I got a health drink. Got another health drink. Got a... One of the magazine years, but nothing really important. One of them I've already read, and the other just doesn't interest me. Going great, how about you? Things are going well for me. Yeah. Got to work on Collagio stuff all day, so I felt pretty good about that. Can't believe that leaves this wait, actually hold on. Can I grab that clothes hanger? Can I grab that clothes hanger? Damn. 
kind of want the clothes hanger to be the endless MVP of this game. Okay, um, but, 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 but yeah, okay, so we got a drawer. Okay, cool, so we can, thank goodness I have a sense of direction now. Yeah, I'm trying to think what else to report. Ah! I went in the lobby. That was not the lobby. Arguably, Collagio? Oh, just college, college. College, just just normal, normal college. Except it's all boring stuff right now. Like it, so I I went to college for programming, but a lot of the classes I've been doing aren't about programming so much as they are about um, so much about the process of how to plan for programming and how to like work as a team and stuff. Which objectively, yeah. objectively I could look at it and be like, yes, this is important. But it's also just like, man, this is boring as shit. You know what I mean? Yeah, sorry, I, I should have said, I should have said college, not collagio. Um. Okay, well, I'm guessing either the elevator. Excuse me. Um. You said. Bitch. Uh, excuse me, excuse me, thank you. Very good. I don't know. It, it's just one of those things of like, okay, I understand. I, I understand why this is a thing and why you want me to work on it, yada, yada, yada. But also, <sighs> it's so boring. It's all. It's all theoretical, you know, none of it is like practical, this is what you can do right now kind of stuff, and so therefore like immediately melts your brain when you read it. So that's why I'm just like, okay. I know these are probably broken, but I figure I should test them in case I have to start it at one floor. Alright, well, nope, okay. Nope, alright. Auto parts? Man, this is auto parts? You have to care. We're on like. Okay, hold on. Sorry, gotta let my dog out. We're on like the fifth floor. And you have an auto parts store up here? You have to carry that shit all the way down. And that's like tires and stuff. Shit's heavy. Okay, I'm in auto parts. Shit's heavy! Uh -huh. Nummy. Who cares about college you have video games? Video games that make you freak out. Panic. Which is ironic that you say that because I'm going to college in the hopes of learning how to make video games. <laughs> Nummy. Nummy, is something with you? Okay, good. I thought something was on your feet. But, um... No, I'm actually going into college trying to learn how to make video games. And there's, like, this one side class... There's this one... Oh, shit! Oh, shit! Is there anything in this room? I feel like there is... No, I don't think so. God, that's a lot of blood I just lost. But, um... I could, actually. This makes me feel a lot better. But, no, I'm going into college to learn programming so I can make video games. And there's this one, um... There's this one self-paced class I'm doing where I'm actually building one, and it's like so much happier just because I can look at what I'm doing as opposed to like here's 15 classes on the theoretical of how to organize for multi-year projects it's like I, I I get it I understand why it's important but also but also a jack ooh ooh maybe I can use that jack to open the drawer Hmm. Hmm. Could use 
so to open the drawer. That'd be pretty clever. Okay. Um, so we need to go to the left. Okay, let's go. Oh, nope, nope. Bitch. Oh, it's unlocked. How's it locked? How's my health doing? I'm, I'm, I'm fine. Okay. Um. Da, 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 da. Okay. So now we can go to the to that side. What in the world is this? Gallery of Fine Arts. Again. Again. Repress her memories. What the hell? Can I, I don't get this picture at all. That's. It's not really symbolic, I bet. I, but it's. Oh, I like that one. Let's see. 5,000? Man, what a world. There's a painting before, and the caption's still around. Flame purify. It's scary somehow? It's scary somehow. It's fucking fire. Fire is scary. What was the one study that like a bunch of people were at? Fire ring. A bunch of people were asked like what they thought the worst way to die is, and it's like being burned alive, and everyone's like, oh geez, it's you mean hell? You mean literal actual hell? Uh who really cares about that? I will call of duty shoot a man if something spooks me. <gasps> Dude, these are probably like old paintings. Dude, the katana! Oh my, oh! No, give me the bit, oh my, oh God! Sort katana, so it's a wagasashi. Oh. <laughs> Let's see. Heather gonna study the blade. Fuck yeah! Oh my goodness! <laughs> okay, so you said if I. Okay, so. Hold on. So, there we go. So that's the basic. Oh, okay, cool. I would like the big one as well. Oh, come on. If I'm gonna properly be a fucking samurai, I, you know, you have, you have your outdoor one and your indoor one. Seems pretty reasonable. Please tell me they spawned a nummy for me to fight. That they're just like, well, you know, you're gonna need to practice. All right, uh, let's go. If we go downstairs to the third floor, we can nab that drawer real quick. It's like, it pretty blatant. Yeah, I need, I need, I need a crow. Actually, hold on. Does it have it on the map? Wrong button. It does not. So I'm guessing if you get a crowbar later, you can like come back. Kind of deal. Because if you're suggesting that I should use my katana as a crowbar, I went the wrong way. My bad. Yeah, if you think for a second that I'm gonna... Everyone knew about half... Ah. Uh, uh, if I had a crow... Uh, that's cute. I like that. You know, it's fun when games, like, reference each other. As long as it's not, like, you know, stupidly blatant. You know what I mean? That's a weird looking for. You know, like, as long as they're not, like... Absolutely everything is a po is a poke at something else, you know? That everything still has its own originality. That's fun. Um So that has a hole in it, but I 
No, the room with the tie had a crate where you inspect the head. It's like, oh, I need a crowbar. Yeah, that's what I mean. Like, I I thought you meant that I literally needed a crowbar, and you're like, no, it's a reference to Half-Life 2. I like that. That's fun. Anyways, I'm going to put this jack in here and really hope it works. All right, here we go. Uh, okay, let's see. I don't know how big this jack is, so I'm going to hope. Oh, come on. That's going to... I was gonna break it. It's a good ass screwdriver. I got a rope. Perfect for hanging myself. I still can't believe they gave me a fucking katana. They gave me a katana. Like. Oh my goodness. Okay, um. Do I still have the screwdriver or is the screwdriver used? Screwdriver's used. Okay, cool. So let's go to the top floor. Yeah. Let's go to the top floor. Just because. The katana is pretty. I know, right? It goes lovely with my shoes and with my hoodie. Fucking love a katana. It's because I'm a weeb. Ah. All right. Well, in that case, okay. You can quick. You can quick attack. It does good damage. All right. Nice. All right. So I'm guessing that ele we have to get up there through the elevator. Sure. Okay. Can't go to the fourth floor. I guess we go back to the third floor, and we go back to that one spot that lets us outside the building, so that way we can explore a little bit, because I think I can walk around the first floor, I just didn't, because I'm lazy. Actually, wait, hold on, what's that mean for just going down all the way here? Maybe I can just take the stairs. Half workout. Dope. No okay. kip. Look, is there anything there? Oh, oh. Uh, Alright. Dope. Alright, cool. So, yep, we gotta go to the third floor. I knew it'd be too easy. No worries, silence crap. You do what you gotta do. No worries. Okay, so we gotta go there. Probably turn off my flashlight. Yep, okay, take a right, then a left, and it's the final one. So. To right, left. Dope. I got my katana. I got some ammo. I got bit a few times. That's not a ladder. Oh, I don't have a map of this area. It's considered a different area? Fuck. Shit. Nothing there, okay. Okay, so we're back in here with Fat Man. Yep, okay, cool. Oh, this is a different area. Oh, fuck. Okay. That that was a one way trip. Ah, fuck. fuck you. Yeah, it's a different building. 
Maybe I got really lucky and, and I just did the thing that I thought. I, I just, without even thinking, did it and it worked. So. I. Okay, so. Try the elevator. Oh, wait. The, oh, the elevator has a. It's a jack. For the elevator. That's pretty self explanatory. Alright, I can do that. I just realized also I didn't take the scabbard with the katana or the sheath or whatever you want to call it. Should grab that. It's fine. I'm sure it'll be fine. Alright, this is a horrible idea. What I'm about to do. Yeah, just. Okay, um. This is a risky freaking maneuver. We want to gotta tie it on. Yes. Um, have I been here at all? I have not. But there's also a save thing. Right over here. Let's see. The latest fad. Fuck yeah, save points, the latest fad. I love it. Okay, how about a map? Actually, no, I have a map of this area, so never mind. Okay. Echo, interiors, and flora. Okay. Mental health clinic. That one's locked. Okay. I say good. We're going to a mental health institution. Good. The fuck is this thing? There's something right there. Dope. Uh, okay. Uh. I guess it's meant to be a showcase, right? Something's up in here. I don't know what, but something's up. Wait, what? Uh. Dark red stamp. Uh. Say something's up, and I don't know that. Um, I knew it. What the fuck? It's being invaded by the other world. By a world of someone's nightmarish delusions come to life. I will just say it out loud then, why don't you go? Like... I was gonna say, you know, have some have some mystery to it. You know, the past few games, we kind of were constantly... <laughs> We were kind of constantly confronted with whether or not the other world was real. Oh, no, not again. We were kind of confronted with whether or not it was real or... She do this too? That face I made was a little freaky, but all right. Oh, God. 
Well, bitch, I have a katana, so... Riddle me this, is this really... You know, is attacking me really the decision you ought to make in life? Holy fuck. Hey, it's a thing from the tree. Oh, it's, oh my goodness. What the fuck? Can I, like, look at it? No? No? Okay. Can I block? Ooh, I can. Oh, dope. Alright, um... I have a katana and a gun. Two guns. Shit. Ah! Ah! Up, 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 up. I assume I don't have a map, right? Oh, I do have a map. What? Poor thing. Did I get some water? I can't see shit. Okay. Uh oh god. Find the holy one killer question mark. Okay. Good to have you back, silence. Good. Good, good, good. But yeah, like you know, we're, it, it was always kind of like a mystery whether or not this was all real or if it wasn't or anything. And now the game's just like, hey man, we're fucking being invaded. Fuck you. Heather. Hold on. That's what you're called now, isn't it? Yeah, that was creepy as all get out. Okay, I don't and have a who katana, are you? but I do have a knife, so... The name's Vincent. Don't forget it, okay? I hate you, Vincent. I'm on your side. I don't fucking... <laughs> so you say. Fucking but how do I know you're not with her? Her? You mean Claudia? Please don't lump me together with her. Don't get near me. She was brainwashed by that crazy old hag. Don't get near me. Well, I guess crazy old hag is a bit harsh. She was your mother after all. The subtitles are not matching My either. Mother? Lip -syncing. What do you mean? I'm you freaking adorable. Don't still, remember. <laughs> so Harry didn't tell you anything. Oh my goodness, am I Harry? I guess he kid? hid the truth. Keep you on his side. Am I Harry from the first game's kid? <laughs> that figures. Uh huh. He is a pretty sneaky guy. That's not true. He was dumb as bricks. Don't talk about my dad like that. Sorry. I apologize. Please don't, you bastard. Please calm down. I have a gun. How do you know my father anyway? Yeah, fuck the truth. Oof. Oh, like, I know. Looks everything. great. This is this is beautiful. I love this. I know about your past, too. Start talking. Then tell me what's going on. Start talking. You don't even know that? That's why I'm asking. If you know everything, then tell me how I can put an end to this. Now, I'm going to sit on the couch yet. and you're going to... Why not enjoy yourself a bit longer? I will shoot enjoy? you. Enjoy? I feel like I'm going crazy. I will shoot you in the leg. Doesn't this place get to you at all? Oh, it gets to me all right. I find it most fascinating. Wait! I'm not finished talking. I knew you were on her side. How do you figure? My pixelated shadow There's will kick your ass! something wrong with you, too. Yeah, that was what, um... Yeah, that's what Redwist was talking about, too. I'm... I'm done with these. I didn't even know what I picked up. I just grabbed everything. But, um... He was talking about that. That's, like, the one big downside of this, um... Who do we call it? Of the PS3 remaster. Oh, my God. What the... F Great, so we got a crazy guy who finds this place fascinating. Oh, look, it's a mental clinic. I should have known. Oh, 
Yeah, that's right. I should probably actually look at what it is. You use this to disinfect cuts and stuff. It foams when you put it on. Oh! Oh, it's fucking... It's... It's fucking hydrogen peroxide. It, it, it's... It's... The th it's... Yeah! Dope! This stuff's great. Fixes infections. Holy shit. Oh, motherfucker. Oh, it's a baby. Fuck the baby up. Shit. We have a katana. I'm not even gonna use it. Again. Hey. Wow, this looks really good. So does does this game have the thing where you can't hit like enemies that are crawling? And you can't block their attacks? Ugh. But does this game have it that if you attack with a melee weapon you can't hit things that are low to the ground? Because I remember that being super frustrating. I don't think I can jump to the floor below me, especially if they set the precedent that I have to have a mattress to do so. Shit. Turn off the light. How hurt am I? How hurt, how hurt, how hurt am I? Okay, I'm, I'm a little banged up. I'm not bad. Okay, and then which door do I need to get to? Shit! With melee. Okay, good. Good, 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 good. Because that was something that was like really frustrating me last time. Yeah, give me these matches. Fuck yeah, I got a matchbook. No more cigarettes for me. I quit for good. Nah, I might start again. I don't. If anything, I should grab those. There might be some guy who's like, oh, I'll do anything for cigarettes. Please. Out of the ground, SH2. I did. I thought those looked familiar. No, no, okay, the, the dragging me on the ground is getting a little frustrating. Okay. There you go. Shit. Ah, no, oh, get off me, get off me, get off me, get off me. I can't oh, no, 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 oh my goodness, get your little snoochy face away from me. Fucking leave me alone. Oh god, I hate uh some whiskey and a good happy burger. Yeah, sounds good, yeah. After all this is said and done. Nice cigarette, I'm just gonna, gonna kick back and chill for a little bit. Oh. The one painting in a bucket. Flame purifies all. By these remains, may a person find slurpers. Worst enemy in the game. Uh, by these remains, may a person find the road to paradise. No way, I've never seen it, but I do know it somehow. I would like to roll to burn the painting. Want to make the flame stronger? Is? Huh? 
Okay, well, okay, okay. Did. I was hoping it'd say flammable on it, you know what I mean? You need another item. Yeah, it stands to reason. I hate walking around and hearing my every footstep. <sighs> okay. Let's. We're gonna need to go around. <sighs> we're gonna need to go around and come back. I'm gonna need some kind of rubbing alcohol. I forgot where I'm going. Okay. Shit, here we go. Oh, come on! Didn't even do anything. Okay, I think it's this way. Good, yeah. There we go. Alright, and then we need to go to the elevator. And this isn't gonna work, but I'm just gonna yep, just to make sure. Alright, um okay, so where do we wanna go now? So we've been to five. Ooh. Oh. Sorry, we've been to five and two. So let's just kind of just go down the line, right? Okay, so five and two. Can't go to six. How about four? Okay. Okay. Oh, I did not realize that my phone. Oop. I did not realize that my phone. Nope. What the fuck? Vibrate, thank you. Oh. Son of a bitch. Bitch. All right, let's try that again, shall we? So we can't do six. We have five and two. We just did four. Okay, let's try three. Let's try one. Wait for something to come out. Of you know, just like trigger. I'm just trying to process what I'm seeing right now. More bodies. More bodies. Are those are those tendrils? Veins? Looks like a fairy tale. Once upon a time, there's a monster living at the gates of the village. It was a very scary and a very bad monster. It would catch people and crunch them up with its big teeth. Villagers were afraid. Oh, my God, my shit. Villagers were afraid of the monster. No one would dare approach the gates. Everyone was stuck inside the village. When the king heard about this, he summoned his knights. The knights eagerly rode out to defeat the monster. Ha, take that. Their swords slashed and their spears flashed. But the, the monster wouldn't die. Passed right into its mouth one by one, horses and all. What was the king to do? He fretted and fussed and paced the floor, but couldn't think of no solution. Soon after, the village priestess came to the castle. She was a very kind and good person. The king asked her to defeat the monster guarding the gates. Maybe the monster is allowed to see you. Can't make what it actually is. The rest is missing. I remember reading this a long time ago. I think I bought it from someone. I don't remember how it ended, though. Did I read the story at the beginning of the end? What the? What? Why not? All bark and no bite? Any house in the way, I can't get past it. It's a ground floor, too. This ought to be the exit. What the fuck 
is that? Like, I... I think that's like its head, or maybe its eye rotating. There's blood. Okay, there's blood moving on it, and I can see the blood moving up and down. I don't know if that's the game developer's way to make it look like it's dripping blood without, like, you know, while having, like, a little circular animation, or if the blood is actually moving up and down it. I don't know, and that bothers me even more. Oh, God. Fuck. Of course it is. Is that thing? That's a fat man. Fuck. Bitch, you're a bitch. I got pork liver, bitch. You're too slow, fat man. Pork liver doesn't burn. Or the uh, projectile, that's not worth the dimension. Oh shit! It can possibly pre represent a uterus again. Again. Or an infant, whatever you want. I was gonna say, doesn't it kind of look more like a fetus than a uterus? Yeah. Oh my goodness. Okay, so I got hit. Ow, that hurt. Okay. Um. There you go. That's fine. Okay, hold on. Okay, hold. On. Okay, so this is in the cafe's fridge. Gotta do something with it before it goes bad. Um, what is the big, does the monster need food? Hey, big guy, you want something to eat? <gasps> Wait, disinfects cuts. This thing is like one big... Important does it burn according to SH logic? It does. I'm sorry, is the pork liver supposed to be the fuel? The pork liver is the fuel? Yep, there's nothing else. That's dumb. That is so- that is stupid. Why would pork liver burn as like a fuel? That makes no freaking sense. Like, at all. Kind of backwards ass. Bitch. Alright, um. A weird logic. Is it was cook. What is with that? I can... Well, okay, I'm gonna save it just to, because I'm here, right? Might as well. Oh, maybe, be maybe because it symbolizes the... F Your 
kidding me. Use it to produce oxygen. Is this any form of realistic? Can you do this? Is that even remotely possible? Also, good news, the building won't burn down because it's all made of metal. We're gonna just kick this bucket over here. Is that a door? What the fuck? I hate it. I hate it. I hate it. I hate it so much. I, I hate it. What the fuck is that? Someone's been hanged. They looked dead right in this strange burn pattern. Squiggling. Squiggling! Oh, wait, no. Okay, probably not actually squiggling. I hate it. I hate I hate this. I hate this so much. Wait, hold on. Okay, so... I think that's... Five... Uh, kind of hard to tell. I mean, ear. Okay, so face to the left is Lisa Garland's. Uh, remind me, who's Lisa Garland? Just in case of spoilers, yeah, remind me, who's, who, who's Lisa Garland again? Uh, the rest of the fairy tale I read earlier? The nurse from, the, uh, <laughs> but why? Unless the other world not only is a reflection of people's subconscious, but also a repository, like it stores them? The priestess accepted the king's request and went to the village gates, but when she saw the monster, she tried to convince it with words instead of killing it. Shut up, you! I'm going to eat you up! The monster didn't listen to a word the priestess said, but she kept trying to convince the monster to give up. It's wrong to eat people, you know. The monster grew very angry at this and attacked her, killing her with a single mighty blow. Well, that doesn't help me and my needs, and kind of it's a, it's a bad it's a bad story and you know teach kids that like the bully wins and what the fuck I'm gonna let it put me down I'm not gonna I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna let it put me down mama didn't raise her quitter Shit. oh fuck you Stuff in the other world for eternity. Okay, but why? Just real quick. Oh my goodness, there's so many of them. But why? Like, okay, I didn't really meet her very much, but wasn't she like a victim? If I remember right, she was a victim. Like it, it was, it was the one, it was the one guy that had the red juice that was like "fuck you, Satan" and threw it, and that we thought was a bad person because he was like dealing in opium or whatever. But then, ah! man, fuck you! <gasps> fuck you! Fuck you! Did she? She was a victim, right? Shit. Okay. Oh, I can't get in my pause menu because I'm on the ground. I want to kill these things, but I'm not supposed to. Alright, that's it. You are all getting... Congratulations, boys and girls. Ladies and gentlemen. You are all getting a gun. That is what you are getting for Christmas, motherfuckers. All getting a gun. Oh, come on. Wait, hold on. Where's the other room I was looking for? Oh, I missed it. Fuck it. Fuck up. Those are awful. Oh my gosh, I just said you're awful. That means you fuck up. 
Okay. But yeah, like, wasn't that her role in the first game that, like, she got, she got murdered? I should have reloaded. Oh, well. That she got, like, murdered by the one drug guy? Wasn't that it? Like, I... Why would that destine her to be... Why would that destine her to suffer in the other world for I remember at the end, like, the... Actually, no, all the endings, she, like, came out of the ground and grabbed the guy and, like, brought her... Brought him down, presumably killing him. But... Oh my goodness, you are the worst! And I'm not allowed to kill you for some ass reason! The other world represents Alessa's desires. Alessa being the girl from the first game? Dude, I got a silver coin. So I shouldn't take him. I mean, I'm no thief. I'm gonna act like one now and then, though. Dude, I'd take it. Dude, take the silver. Dude, the silver. They're just, uh, of course, not funny. I guess I'd say that would be nice to have, but I think I'll pass. Dude, silver. Silver represents purity. Fucking slap some va uh, slap, slap some werewolves. Uh, maybe it's water. Thus, one's life turns to riches. What was a bag of silver coins is now the number in a book. Your yet faith hath no price. Ah, but do people know this? Number in a book. I would like to examine it. How many are there? How many are there? When I say girl from the first game, was it, was Alessa the, was Alessa the old lady that was summoning Satan, the daughter that was the first half? Cause your daughter was named Chloe, right? I remember, I remember. I also don't know what the fuck this silver coin is going to do for me. I have no idea. Else I give it to the monster? Alessa was the daughter of Dahlia, the dark hair. And Dahlia was the scary old lady. Okay. Wait, how come she, how come she gets powers over the other world? Who the fuck does she think she is? You can use the coin in the room where you... Ah! Oh! Oh, so I figured I figured it would give me an option automatically. There you go. Dope. Oh, you're kidding me. You're kidding me. How the fuck? Take another silver coin. Oh, come on! Uh, it looks real though. Uh, oops. Thank you for telling me that. Alright, so. Okay, cool. So we just gotta get to the first floor. Fuck you! Fuck you. Fuck you. Actually, yeah, if I don't... There. Since I can't kill them for some ass reason... 
If I shoot them enough for them to lay down, I can then run past, maybe. I don't Or is it, or is that more talking about the idea that like coins have changed to bills, have changed to like numbers that you see on your bank account? I'm gonna shoot you. I'm not gonna shoot you. It's probably cruel if I did that to you. Okay, uh, here we go. Life charts. Good stuff. Nope. Okay, this area is dead end. That's just shambling. Say lunch, every motherfucker. Okay. 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 Look at something. Something's piqued my interest. Don't know what, but something. Oh, hey. The end of that fairy tale. Okay. The king and his people shed tears at the death of the kind priestess. God took pity upon them and granted their wishes, healed the priestess. Wow, thanks, God. It's pretty dope. The priestess opened her eyes just as she had done every morning of her life. She went once more to the monster's lair. Oh, uh, sorry, can, I'm sorry, can we read that again? Tu fui eco eris? Sorry. Weird writing. <gasps> Shit. What was that? I, I would like to read that again. I would like to read that again. Okay, da da da. Let's see. Fool, you wish to die again? No, this time it's your turn. The priestess had come to defeat the monster once and for all. She says, Fuck this kindness, bullshit! As the priestess was very, very kind, she felt sad about this task, but it had to be done. Swords and spears won't work. Arrows and bullets will just bounce up. Yep, 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 bullets. You can't kill me, the monster laughed, but the priestess used neither sword nor spear. She chanted but a single spell. Tu fui ego eris. Do you know what happened then? The monster let out a huge cry and then died and vanished. And came here! All right, so let's just re real quick rearrange these letters. So it means anything different. Sire, Oge, Ayuf, Ut. Okay, it's probably not it. Tu fui ego eris. Thus the village were able to use their gates once more. Well, they lavished their gratitude upon the priests, but they all lived happily ever after. Tu furu. I'm sorry, one more time. Tu fui ego eris. To fui ego eris. To fui ego eris. One of the endings has Lisa dragging a screaming coffin away to his death. This is the last time we see her. Yeah, that's what I was talking about. I saw that. I, I, saw, I saw that happen. It was just like, oh shit. And then he he died, question mark? And I was like, eh, whatever. Fuck that guy, right? To fui ego eris. To fui ego eris. To fui ego eris. To fui ego eris. To to fui ego eris. What was that? I noticed there are no more slurpers here. Presumably, because the game's like, we know you're gonna go. I'm, I'm sorry. Oh, I said it out loud and it killed him.
Oh. Oh. Well, sure, but I didn't miss anything in Barbara. Get the fuck out of here. I didn't miss anything important there. I know where I'm going. So, what am I doing again? I, I want to go home to be with my dad. <gasps> is is this where I live? Is this where I live? There better not be any weird shit in here. Better not be any weird shit here. This is where I live. Wait, hold. Oh, wait, wait, actually, wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. Uh, uh, huh. Daisyville apartment 102 is carved into the key. 102. That's not my place. That's not my place either. Man, this place is creepy as shit. That's not my place. That's not my beautiful car. You're not my beautiful wife. Oh. Oh, good. Good. So this dude in here looks like some. Looks like having someone spit on your sacred place. Uh. Gonna need my father. Father who may or may not be Harry. Harry, whose last name I don't remember. Honestly, he was a boring ass character, so I didn't care. I am home. Roll credits. The nightmare's over. F fuck that place. Lisa was essentially one of the lessons monsters manifested since she's, since she's dead before the events of the first game. It's just implied that she was condemned to suffer in the other world. Ow. Ow. Also, did the game just freeze on me? Which just reminded me, actually. <laughs> there it is, Silent Hill 4. I never bought it. <laughs> you guys can't see that what I'm doing on my computer. I could be doing anything. Wink, wink, nudge, nudge. <laughs> nah, I'm not that one. Who was the guy that was on CNN or whatever? And like... Essentially, was caught masturbating on 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 like a feed or whatever. Good times. Owned games. I own no games. Wait, what? Letting the days go by, let the water hold me down, same as it ever was, same as it ever was. I are, are, are you singing the part of the rock song? I'm sorry, I don't understand. Hmm, this game's wishlisted, but I haven't bought it, so I should purchase it. I will do so right now. Anyways, I think I crashed the game. Gonna be honest, I'm pretty pretty sure I crashed the game somehow. So let's just uh The reason I'm doing this right now is because it just occurred to me that um if we did finish this game really early. Oh great, the PS3's dead! Good thing we fucking saved. But um, it just occurred to me that if we um, if we finished like everything right now, you know what I mean, that that I wouldn't have the next game ready to go. My order was made successfully. Fantastic. I would like to install this game. Yeah, it just occurred to me I wouldn't be ready to roll right into the next one. And it's like, ah, oh, shut down the PS3. There you go. <sighs> Let's see. Oh, uh, perfect. Dumping stuff. Keep this game up to date. Smash the window. Of course, install. Great. So it is installing now. It will take approximately. Oh, it's only two point three gigabytes. I just blew ten bucks on Steam. I hope you said I. We did. We did. Don't worry. We did. We did. Hundred percent. We did. But now's a perfect opportunity. Everyone stand up and stretch. 
Stretching is good. Like this, can you hear? Did you hear my arm crack there? Ooh, ooh, stretch your arm this way, stretch your arm this way. Yeah, that is the one downside to me wanting to, you know, moving into food from a call later night streams is that I get sleepy. I don't want to get sleepy, I want to stay awake and shake my butt. You can't see my butt though, so ha ha, joke's on you. Now I'll stretch this thigh. Now stretch this thigh. Hey, that kind of looks like the Hey, okay. Everyone get a good stretch in? Hope everyone got a good stretch in. Because we're about just to walk right into the next yep, some part of this game we consider violent or cruel. That's fine. I love that they say that, that it's like, hey, by the way, this game might be violent or cruel, and then the first thing they show, like, the first fucking thing is, like, two bodies, like, convulsing with blood coming out of them while there's some kind of torturer. This is like, ah, fuck! <laughs> oh, no! <laughs> yeah, we're good. We are all sorts of, see? We're all sorts of good. Now, Dad, don't be alarmed that I have a gun. Hey! <sighs> Why is the door open? Dad, I'm home. Father! Listen, something really crazy is going on. Is my dad dead? I think we should... Dad? Father? Dad? Why is my flashlight on? Oh my goodness, it is Harry from the first game! Yeah, this is gonna be some. Oh. Wait, did you see that painting? It had someone hugging something, but it's just a rectangle. What the fuck was that? No. No. Yeah, it. She's hugging. No. Or oh, maybe it's actually just a piece of wood. No. So, is this Harry from the first game? My dad. <laughs> Goes how much the devs like Harry. I didn't like Harry either, to be honest. So I don't. Yeah, it's Harry Mason. I only liked him because his name sounded like Perry Mason. To be completely honest. Guess who's going for fucking revenge? This game is considered a sequel to one. <laughs> Get your gun. Get your gun. Yo, I was just thinking we haven't had a boss fight for a little bit. I was just considering. Did you do this? Oh, fuck! Oh. You're late. Oh, what the fuck? Why? Why? Revenge for 17 years ago, for one thing. Oh, don't tell if me. If not for him, our dream would have come true. Whatever. You're summoning Satan. And then he took you away from us. Okay, yeah, so straight up, you're... You're... Well, you're not... <gasps> I'll kill you, you bitch! I like that a lot better than the dialogue. <sighs> there is another reason. To fill your heart with hate. Oh, my heart's full of hatred, motherfucker! It must be this way. One day you'll understand why. I rolled to shoot her. No, I'll never understand. Oh, I hate that smile. You must try to remember me and your true self. I rolled well. to shoot her. You will birth a god and build an eternal paradise. I would like to use my action surge and I uh, roll to. Yeah! <laughs> Motherfucker. Give me a reason not to. Give me a reason not to. He's the one who killed your father. I merely gave the order. Then you're just as bad! So, what will you do? Uh, shoot, I'll shoot you. I'll take whatever moment I have for- I've been waiting, 
where all begins. I'll, I'll take the moment I can to shoot you. In the town of Silent Hill. And then I'll... That guy can block your attacks. Well, that's unfortunate. Oh my goodness. Yeah, they're taunt fights! They're taunt fights. Side. That's what I was thinking, you know. Means a pistol would be the most advantageous one here. I kinda wish I could lock on him. Yeah, the aim in this game isn't very good though. Bitch. Also, are those mannequin arms? What the fuck? Nope, okay, can't do that. Shotgun is pretty useful here. I was thinking pistol just to take him Okay. <sighs> yeah, sorry, I need a little bit of a breather. <laughs> oh my goodness! You hit me. I can't believe you hit me. Let's have some words. It's for my father. This is for ruining the ball. This is for you being an ugly son, of a bitch. Let me kick you. Uh, I gotta reload. Oops. Bitch. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It's good to know that I am pretty damn maneuverable with a shotgun. I was like, Dad, you would have been proud of me. I just shotgun the shit out of a monster. I don't know what to say. I would like you then to- Then don't say anything. I'm fine, so- I'm not just fine. get out of here and leave me alone! I'm really not fine. Calm down. I, I just... No, don't tell... Uh. Calm down? How am I supposed to My do dead that? dad! My father is dead. He's murdered. Do you have a car? Do you have a car? We're going to fucking Southern Hill. Get out! This is all your fault. It's not. If it weren't for you. It's I'm not. Sorry. It's not his... Go! It's... This is pretty understandable, but it's not his It'll fault. It'll make you feel better. I will. Give me your car. Going to fucking Southern Hill. Is he okay like this? Sure. What else can I do? <sighs> There's no one here to give him a decent burial. Douglas be a creeper after teenage girls. Yeah, fucking Douglas, motherfucker. <sighs> Start explaining shit. Actually, I'd like to take a shower, but also... I'm sorry, Dad. I'd like to take a shower, but I just want you to know, Douglas, I'm gonna have a gun at all times. What'll you do now? Take me to damn Silent Hill. I'm going to Silent Hill. Ah, title drop! <laughs> What's in Silent Hill? I don't know, fucking demons say... I don't know. Well, cult, apparently, weird flesh monsters. A lot of, a lot of. You think it's safe? No. Of course it isn't. That's why you're gonna I come don't with know me. What kind of hell is waiting for me there? You're coming with me. You're gonna but be my I've wingman. Got no other choice. You're my wingman. I, I don't care about God or 
paradise. I care about God. If that's what she believes, then fine. Yeah, I'm, I'm Christian. I care but about she God. She won't but... get away with what she did. We're gonna shoot the shit out of her. I'm angry. When I find her, I'll kill her myself. This is so much more compelling than Last of Us 2. Just say it is. Revenge doesn't solve anything. <laughs> hey, look, it's the moral of Last not, of Us Part 2. That's what I'm gonna do. Hey, look at that! How are you gonna get there? Uh, you None have a car? Business. Do you have a car? No, it is his business. Does he have I'll a car? I'll give you a ride. Thank you. I, I don't need your help. Yeah, but it's too far to walk. It's like it's a three Besides, it's a three hour drive. Responsible for this. You need to explain how you're partly responsible. I don't see how you are. Look, uh, I'll bring the car around back. Come out when you finish saying goodbye. Also, you're gonna help me. You know, you might die too. Yeah, it's it's fucking dangerous, man. That's fine. <laughs> Nobody's gonna cry over my grave anyway. All right, look here, dark grizzled detective. I actually want to hear what you're gonna say. Also, I need a fucking shower. <sighs> Problem so I wonder if my dad would be mad at me for thinking that way. Can I use my... Hold on. But yeah, let's go to Silent Hill while uh, leaving the decaying corpse of my father on the bed. I mean... What else are we gonna do, really? Explore Heather's room? We can do that. That's gonna look right. I would like a shower. I would like. I would like a shower. Maybe a change of clothes. Man. Wait a second. Now Harry can't do the alien ending. Oh no! I don't know which way is. I assume that's the way out. What? Who could eat something in a situation like this? You gotta eat something, okay? Doesn't need to be a lot, just something. You know, you gotta keep your energy up. Although all these games too, do tend to be all within one day, so. What? Liar. How's your dad? Like, holy shit. This is my room, right? Morn always comes as corny, but it's true. But if your eyes are closed, it always feels like night. I got stun god battery. What the fuck? What the fuck? Stun god battery. Hoarder. What do you mean hoarder? What do you put? Rude. What do you mean hoarder? Fuck you, man! I'm, 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 fuck you! I guess that's a stun gun. It has to touch him though, so it's very short range. Wait, where our dad gave this to me just in case? What a good dad! All right, so let's just test it. Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! Now is that ammo, or does I actually have to touch? That is ammo. Okay. Nope. The stun gun short range was powerful, just stuns enemies almost completely. Great. Awesome. Cool. Non lethal, I'm guessing. I don't remember exactly when, but I think I got to the direction. Not that useful. What? Cool. I like it. Besides, Douglas should be waiting for me outside. Did I get my own bathroom? I would like to change my clothes. Or at least clean off the blood. Did I clean off the blood? Oh my goodness. Alright, anything else we need for anything else stopping us? Yeah, anything, anything stopping us before we head out? Aww. 
just as usual, the tech novels, my dad loved them. Detective novels. Don't tell me that Douglas isn't real. Don't tell me that. No, you're gonna go. All right, fantastic. We got all sorts of health items. I have so much beef jerky. Can I eat the beef jerky? So I think I'll pass. You sure about that? Could could be good. Could be tasty. I know this is the wrong way. I'm just looking. I'm expecting Pyramid Head to to be fucking here. Which is actually accurate on two statements. I, ex I expect him to be here and he's probably going to be fucking something. In which case, I will shoot the shit out of him because Pyramid Head is a bitch. The only reason he lived was because the game arbitrarily decided that he was going to be invincible. Otherwise, he was a bitch. Are you a personification from my dad's memories because I of his love for detective novels? Vincent. Valentine? Vincent? Is Vincent Valentine? He's a friend of yours, right? I'm not sure. Oh, wait, that Vincent. He said when we get to Silent Hill, to look for a guy named Leonard. And he gave me this map. Ah, oh, thank you. Fuck you, Vincent. Is what it Vincent Valentine? Do? We can't trust him, but we've got no other choice. Next time you see that, that son of a bitch, you shoot him. Okay? Vincent said on this. <sighs> Fucking kill him. Yeah, take this too. What's this? It's covered in blood already. Your father was holding it. Simple works to my dear daughter. Next time you see that son of a- I, I can't read this in the car. I will get sick. Yeah, are you a personification of my dad's love for detective novels because you're the most stereotypical detective man ever? Started raining. Let her sleep. Shut the fuck up. Let her sleep. Are you sleeping? Are you sleeping? No, 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 no. Go to you sleep. Cold? Get some sleep. What's the deal with Silent Hill anyway? Ah, no, it's a kind of cool game. Used to be a nice, quiet little town. Then those, those now, damn cultists moved in. You've been there. Curse you, immigration. <laughs> oh, Once. On a missing person's case. Never did find him. But I tell you, that's one screwed up town. Those My damn cultists! Work, you hear a lot of nasty rumors. About cultists. I was born and raised there. No. Sorry. You weren't raised there. Didn't mean there. to offend you. No offense taken. The place was a hellhole. Why would we go back? Why would I raise a kid there? Anyway, I thought you grew up in Portland. What's wrong? You feeling sick? I can't read in the car, man. My head's pounding. Like the worst hangover ever. I have a lot of experience with hangovers. Maybe you're car sick. No. I'm just trying to remember. Good stuff. My childhood. Something terrible happened in Silent Hill 17 years ago. I was bored! No, I know. A woman named Dahlia. Yeah, fuck her. She tried to summon the ancient god of the town. It was straight up Beelzebub. It was straight up Satan. I wish I was joking. It was Satan. She offered up her very own daughter. The water warping my face. That's crazy. Maybe so, but it place worked. Box. The girl gave birth to a god. That's so stupid. I love it. I love those stupid little things. That's oh, great. You see, the girl had special powers. Powers? Her classmates called her a witch. It was me. She can make things happen with her mind. Can I make things happen with my mind? She could kill people just by wishing for it. That's fucking awful. But in the end, the god was killed by a single person. My father, Harry Mason. 
guess it wasn't much of a god if it could be killed by a human being. Shotguns for days. So many shotguns. But I think Claudia is trying to do the same thing again. Two and to I've been chosen as the sacrifice. Two you thumbs got kill the some guy. kind of power in you too. I have a gun. After the oh. god was killed, knives, too. the girl reappeared. She was holding a baby in her arms. Take this shit, God! Before she died, she gave the baby to my father. I raised him as a single father because I couldn't save the one girl. Ah! Oh well, I couldn't save the cop. Ah, he loved me just like I was his very own daughter. I only had one stint with psychic powers. Even one. though he didn't know who or what I was. What a boring ass guy. Bro. It was so sudden. To tell you, tell you how happy you made me. Those tires are misshapen. Holy shit, you see that shit? God, that was oblong as fuck. Douglas is gonna fucking. What? Douglas is gonna bite it. How? I'm gonna head for that Leonard guy's house. You check out the hospital. Why? You got the map, right? Yeah. You gonna be okay alone? I I'm mean, not a child, you know. Am I 17 or 18? Are you sure it's not you who's afraid to be alone? I have a, I have two guns. Do you want a katana? Do you want mace? Do you have You're a right. mace? I am afraid. Would you like a mace and a pipe? I'm 50 something years old. Who in their right mind would I've not be afraid? Like this. Holy shit, there's man eating monsters. The I world's feel like I'm dreaming. The world's turning into rust! Like a nightmare, I'd say. She's 17. Damn! Yeah. If any of you loot her, you're going I'm to fucking wake jail. Up have a smoke already. I do I show grab cigarettes here for you. When you finish looking around the hospital. Okay? I'll switch the voice head for Douglas died a month Roger. before the game was released in 2000. Oh, so we never got You have to save in the with your notepad, yo. Save the notepad. No. That is very sad to hear, though. I mean, it's been 17 years, but still, he it is a good voice actor. Well, I, I guess this is the original voice actor. Oh, that familiar sight. Oh, that familiar blood on the ground. Or maybe that's oil. I'm breaking down. Oh, the memories. All right, so we have to go to the hospital. Great. Oh, it's that map. Oh. Whoa, 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 whoa. Where am I going the right way? Yeah, I'm going the right way. All right, tight. Hi, ho, hi, ho. Here we go. I'm going to the left. Where are the mannequin leg monsters? Why is it curving me towards here? This is weird. I would like to leave. Yeah, it's like... Wait. Hold on. Uh, 
on dad's notebook. As always, this should be novelized. <gasps> to my dear Dato. I hope this will never come to any use, Mary. It's better if you never know. More than anything else, I fear the possibility of you're going away far from me. You gotta tell the truth. That's why I'm writing this before I'm lost in death and oblivion. Oh, you poetic. You can also visit Heaven's Night. Is there any benefit to visiting Heaven's Night? Because that's the that's the strip club, right? That has something to do with who you are. It all started 24 years ago. Coming back from vacation, my wife and I found a baby on the side of the highway. Since we were childs, we thanked God for letting us meet this child, this girl. We took her home. Three years later, my wife died. Another four years, 17 years ago, I came to Silent Hill. I heard the girl's pleas and took her with me, not knowing why she wanted us to go there. It was it was there that the little girl went away. Not that she actually went away, nor did she die. Returned to her original self. That's what Dahlia Gillespie said. That was the young woman burned by her, her mother as a sacrifice to God. A lesson. Um... Half her soul escaped those flames and went on to live in a baby in that girl of mine of ours. Uh, so years passed before that half a girl returned to Sun Hill and made a less whole again. Newly strengthened, she vowed to kill God. Ah, yeah, now. God, a fetus nestled into the sacrificial girl's room was someone with the illusion. I don't think that's God so much as something you're deciding is God. With someone with the usual rights, this was Les's wish. No matter what the outcome, even if her own existence were at stake. But that wish was not granted. My instruction meant she prayed and said for the girl's return. I alone couldn't bring her back. Dahlia did it. I only helped with the birthing ceremony to bring God out of Alessa. I don't think it's God. To... The newly born God wailed once and was dead. It was, I shot Satan. All from that girl's and probably Alessa's conscious resistance. I don't know. That's not the end. After God vanished in a glow of light, Alessa reappeared and gave me a baby. She looked a lot like that girl so long ago. I don't. I was gone dead. There was nothing I could have done to help. I simply clutched the baby to my chest and ran off. The whole thing felt like a dream, but I had proof that it wasn't. The girl was nowhere to be found, and in my arms, the baby. You can meet Maria. I don't want to meet Maria. Fuck, we gotta go meet Maria. <sighs> Fuck Maria. Okay. Now 17 years have passed. It feels like only yesterday, and again, it feels like a million years ago. I confess I had reservations at first about raising that baby because I love her. Existence was thoroughly unexplainable. I thought, did you ever take her to the doctor? I thought she could be that young woman who snatched away my beloved dog and that led to sinus anger. There were times when I put my little hands around her tiny little throat. That's creepy as shit. Several times I even considered abandoning her. That's what a terrible person I am. But I decided to raise her at all. I just couldn't seem to let her go. And she, when you look at me, you laugh. So even now I can't forget about that girl. There's a few items. Okay. No, if I saw Maria, I would start flipping shit. It'd be like round two with the succubus. But I love you. I have no doubts about that. That's all I ask you to my precious daughter, Harry Mason. No. We need to run. Alright, so where is the... Oh, heaven. it's on the way. It's on the way. Oh, perfect. Ah! <gasps> Son of a bitch. Fuck you. Hey, okay, so let me get my relaxed. As long as there's no more fucking smokers. Those things were awful. Although I do have a gun now. So. Oh, you're kidding me. You're kidding me. Fucking. <gasps> Wait, the bowl. The bowl of ammo. This guy too. Back then. How immediately alarming! The camera's being a little weird with me right now. Oh, am I gonna find Eddie? I gotta find that A. Yeah, I'm tired. I'm tired. I'm tired. I'm tired. I'm damn casting. And I die. Okay, cool. This is the entrance. Fuck you. Fuck you. What the fuck? I'm back here for nothing. This motherfucker over here thinking they're hot shit. They ain't. 
Back there. Oh, look at me. I can run faster than you because my head faces slap each other as I, as I move. Blah, blah, blah. You can't kill me because if you kill me, you'll get the bad ending. Blah, blah, blah. Damn. It. That wasn't a factor. I'd fucking coat the streets with your blood. I gen okay, so for as much as I'm giving it shit, I kind of honestly really hope that like some mannequin leg enemies show up or like one or two smokers or like oh god or like the dogs and the pterodactyls and maybe like the crawly frogmen. You know, like a few of the enemies from the old games. Just as like a shout or not shout back uh you know what i mean like a just like a hey cookie oh good here we are <sighs> good shit oh yeah Tourism, I had forgotten, but it's true. Sun Hill's a rich resort town. Welcome to Sun Hill. Uh, Roger Wilmer. Oh, there's some ammo there. Cool. Probably not going to be able to. I'm waiting for it. Like, I'm going to shine my flashlight over something. That would have been the perfect spot for Maria's laugh. Just like this little, like... <laughs> you know what I mean? It would have been so scary. Whom's to made that sound? But... Who's ready to play with nurses with booty shorts and pipes? Whom's made the bad decision to get near me? I was joking! Why don't I have my gun equipped? Hi, Heather, I'm the succubus, nice to meet you. He's like, hey. Whom's made the poor life decision of getting near me, motherfucker? I'm gonna shoot you just to remind you who's- Oh, there's two of them! Okay, wait for me. Oh my goodness. This is more for my own giggles, by the way, than else. Uh, I'm aiming at you. Oh, shit! Man, you're- See, this pistol doesn't do shit! Where's the other one? Nope, I'm kicking you too. Well, that was completely unnecessary, but fun. Yes, I recognize I effectively made it more likely that I'll get the bad ending. You know what? I wanted to do it, so I did. I thought I had a map of this area, what the fuck? I guess I don't have a map of this. I guess it's full of fucking nurses who are pretty damn fat. Oh, hey. Oh, it's, it's, uh, it's the same one. Oh, I hate it. Uh... Oh, girl. Nah, uh, fucking. Oh, no. First playthrough of SH3, the ending you get is hardwired. Oh, it is? Wow. That's dumb. Um, it's dumb. 
one good, one bad, one UFO. We're gonna go for the good because it's hardwired. So. I'm stubborn as fuck, so we'll still go for what I assume is good. Oh, great. Oh, good. The day has finally come. That's right. The day when you and I will meet. However you play. Yeah. I was always thinking of you here in this gloomy style. I never knew your name or face until today. And I know I know you're the one I've been waiting for. And haven't you been waiting for me? That's why you came here. Oh, how I love you, Heather. Fuck you! Oh, I want to give you my prize doll. I made a criminal Armenian and the start of this everlasting love. I can already see your smiling face. Not if I'm going to birth God. We ain't have. It's going to be a consensual relationship. I ain't fucking you. Stanley Col Fuck you, Stanley Coleman. The fuck is this doll? Disgusting. I won't touch that with a 10 foot pole. I mean, it's just, it's just a doll, but I'm trying to look at the doll. I, I would like to inspect the doll. Is the OG simp? Oh, God. That doesn't make me feel good. Yeah, fucking introduce him to a fucking katana, Stanley, you piece of shit. Well, I mean, if he's con now that I think about it, though, if he's convinced that he's gonna, if he's gonna be with me, and I'm essentially gonna birth God, I mean, I imagine he'd be pretty excited to be the dad. Except, if this is Jeebus, if this is Jeebus, then I just become pregnant one day. You don't get to put the baby in me, piece of shit. God does that. And a lot of people try to twist that to be like, haha, God had sex with her. Now I think he just kind of pointed and it happened. But re regardless, you don't get to put a baby in me because you're fucking cult thing. Fuck you. That looked weird for a second. Okay, it's a straight lock. Man, fuck you, you piece of shit. I'm gonna get tired of your ass. I'm Katani, you're out. Uh, I was hitting you a lot. Oh, wait, I can block. Man, get fucking wrecked. Okay. But you haven't visited yet. for this leaner guy. Okay. What did you talk about? Room S12. Which one's S? Uh, presenting mild audio-visual hallucinations, emotional disability, obsessive ideas, suspect mild schizophrenia. We'll continue observation. Ah, great! It's him! Leonard is... I already forgot his name. Stanley! Basically, Colin Crofter, the strongest of justice, however, according to reports, becomes very fine. And also, I was drinking the... Damn, damn. The other one is for Stanley Coleman. Uh, usually pass are cowardly, also egotistical. Oh, good. Sometimes show an accent, obsessed with touch, triptych, this is caused by innocence. Use caution. Again. Again. Do not store drugs. Fourth shot. Again. Again. Okay. I probably shouldn't be killing all the nurses. I just have a vendetta against them. So I'm gonna kill the nurses. Okay. But. Okay, so, Silence, I think you were there when Redwoods told me. Joking about that before. 
We're joking that was Pepto Bismol, like a V8 or something. But okay, so I think you're there on red with. A cookie, a toothbrush, a spoon, a Christmas card, a clock. Whoever was probably used to be. Why did they do this in the first place? Was this an I spy? But it's really. I can't even pull it off. That doll is there again. The organization has to be shut up in here. They mean to break my will to make me forget about all that. But I'll stay sane even if they throw me in here with the lunatics. How about if I stick this to the wall? What would be worth this? You can feel it out, can't you? With that junk, those nasty wrenches won't stop using. Give me that pipe. If a thing has no meaning, there's no reason for it to exist at all. It just says you exist for me. That's, once again, near Automata. I would like to have a word with you. But why haven't you taken my doll with you? Oh, great. So you, oh, good. You're only confused. Oh, great. You saw me not take it. What's the matter? How cute you are, Heather. Fuck you. Stanley's following me. I appreciate that. I appreciate that at all. Yeah, fucking. But okay, sorry. My the, the question I had earlier. So why did Red was tell me not to kill things? If if you're saying I can kill things, it doesn't matter. Wait, hold on. With those awful things, those. Hang on. Is he saying I can use a... He's saying they're, they're carrying around pipes and I have a pipe. Say I can... Okay, great. So I have a katana. Only mad if you play through the game once. So like on your second playthrough, you mean? Right? To get the bad end, you have to kill all enemies, take damage one of the choice you haven't got, got to yet. Yep, second playthrough. Okay. Surprise, motherfucker! Fucking go down! Surprise, motherfucker! I'm gonna kick you in the crotch, motherfucker! I think you're hot shit! Surprise, motherfucker, if I get to do mess with me, fuck you, you little piece of shit. Y'all, y'all have the same haircut, motherfucker. You're still twitching. You're still twitching. Well, okay, now that we got that out of our system. There really is nothing in this room. I was kind of hoping I'd kill one of them, and they'd be like, oh, shit, look, she's got a scalpel. Blah, blah, blah. Well, I can't guess. There's some room full of this when I'm just a troll you. I was kind of hoping they'd drop something, you know? Kind of, kind of, you know. What's that? Is useful against nurses. Yeah, it's working pretty well. All right, hold on. Um, Let's check the visiting room again. Because what I'm guessing is supposed to happen is... We unstick the key, we use the key, we go to the next floor. But I haven't found... Wait, what? Is that okay? 
or something. There's that elevator. There's that, there's that, ele yeah, just to go, I was just about to say, like, there's that elevator. S12, S7. I forget which one, so I could open it. Might be S12 and S7. Who are the guys there? Is that one guy who like killed himself or something? I don't remember. It's pretty dark in here. I think I want to keep a flashlight on if I get a say in the matter. Stanley, I swear to fucking goodness. I'd like to tell Stanley. I'd like to tell Stanley to politely fuck off. You may not yet realize your own true feelings, but you sense them unconsciously. Fuck you! And so you're trying to get close to me. That's a bridge to the path to paradise. I will kill you. If the doctor's locked, oh, if the door's locked, open it. Use the password for the prison gates. Doctor, I've forgotten his name. Anyway, that clock has it posted. He should be here too. I mean, four numbers would've been, would've been good, but he kept on going. What? I'm not there, aren't you? You're a I long for you, but you're so cruel. Still, I want you, Heather Stanley Cole. Fuck you, Stanley Coleman. What a fucking creepy piece of shit. Of course it is. You know the next time I go over there, it's gonna be fucking gone. Hey. I'm kill things. What is this? Nail polish remover. S some perfume. Nail polish remover. Right, S7 and 12. I was trying to remember what, um, in either Silent Hill 1 or 2, I was trying to remember which which rooms were opened. Because some of them were open. One of them had Pyramid Head in it. What can I use? The nail polish. Can I use nail polish for the, for the glue? Maybe? Thank you. 
He's talking about me. Okay, so... Okay... Place my left hand on your face. Okay, so talk about two eyes, face, and then drilling the hole. Alright, okay, is this the hand? Cuz... Wait, three. Three, three. One. Three. Yeah, give, give me a little... Okay, so it's not the dashes, damn it. I'm not really getting any numbers from there. It's not like he was saying I will kiss you two times and then rip off your ear three times and da da da. So, well, you do that. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna stand right here and just you know, just just kind of uh, and go me me. That's disgusting. But thank you. All right. Um. Okay, so that's top left. Um, I'm top left. I imagine this is bottom middle. Top left, bottom middle. left ear so top left bottom middle middle right Is the middle? Because it's your. Wait, my left hand, right? So it'd be the right side. It, it would be her right. So that'd be one. And then, see, okay, that's what gets me, right? Uh, beautiful and small. I'm so happy. So there's no numbers. There's no numbers. Unless this is a number. Cause that would be bottom middle, right? Cause the, what? Yeah, one through. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. So one through your eyes. My left hand on your face, right? So left hand it would be in this side of the face. So that. Yeah. So left hand would be. Left left hand would be on her right eye, so her right. So that'd be one. There's nothing there. So, yeah, I was right then. So it'd be one. Biting your tongue, right? So that's probably eight. Unless biting at your lips is another eight. Uh, 
Wait, what? You actually have to ignore the eye part of the riddle. You only start when the blood reaches the ear. Well, fuck. Hang on. I hate this. This is gross. When the blood reaches the ear? So we skip this part. So this is the warmth of the blood. The ear is the first number. So it's not the tongue either then. It brushes against my cheek. I want it to creep up to my lips so I can sink my teeth into its flesh. Well, you didn't say which one you're with. I imagine if... It, okay, so if I'm holding with my left hand, right? I imagine it would be her left ear, right? So it would be left ear, mouth, right, left ear. That's confusing as shit. Because that doesn't explain what the... Because the cheeks aren't involved. Wait, so... Tender ear, so the left ear, it brushes against my cheek. So if your left ear, if, if, okay, so your ear, left ear, so it's probably his left cheek, right? So it's left ear, left cheek, mouth, mouth? Was it after the mouth then? Because nose. Oh wait, no. Left cheek. He says the bottom. So right, because eyes. So left ear, left cheek, mouth, mouth. See, if I had to guess on my own, I'd be like, hold the left hand on the face, so it's a, so it's this side, so it's the right eye. I'd be like, it's the right eye and the left ear and the left cheek and the mouth. But or I'd be like, it's the left eye or right eye, the left ear, the blah blah blah, or like blah 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 blah. All right, that doesn't make sense. Not gonna lie, that left ear is six. Right, so it'd be like. Right, that, that, that's what I was doing. That's what I was doing. It'd be like, this is the left ear, and it'd be the left cheek, and then it'd be mouth and mouth. Right, so like, so like, this is nose, eye, eye, forehead. So, ear, ear, cheek, cheek, mouth. So. Because I, I would look at this, and I would be like, uh, it's an eye socket, right? So it would be, because the left hand is on the right side of her face, like this, and then go, right? Like a little JoJo. So, right? So it would, it, you first use your left hand to poke her eye. The blood drops down to her ear, four. But why is it why is it the eye and not the blood? Okay, so huh? 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 Oh, no, wait, hold on. No. Wait, the left hand 
left hand poke out her eye, and blood drops down to her ear. Right, so, eh, then you uh, the other ear, eh, then you bite her tongue, eh, eh. Gross. Hold, hold on. Yeah, cause, the, cause okay, so you go for the blood and then, then you bite her. That was dumb. Like, it, it, I wish there'd be a little bit more. Because that was like, logically, I would have gone for the eye. I would have gone for the eye, not the blood that came down. Like, kind of wish there was like a something there. You know? Or if it was short, not as creepy. I don't, I don't feel good about, I don't feel good about any of this. I don't, I don't like, I don't, I don't like, I feel uncomfortable. I feel violated, frankly. Actually, yeah, just be a harp sauce. I, yeah, that, that could have been done better. That could have been a lot less weird, creepy shit. Speaking of creepy shit. Yeah, same, picking the eye would be even more logical. Yeah, because I, I would be like, okay, your eye, and then you mention your ear, and then you mention your tongue, and then you mention your cheek. And it stands to reason, if I'm holding you with my left hand... If I'm holding you with my left hand, our faces will be like this. So therefore, it'll be this cheek, which from your perspective is your left. Like that, that would have made sense to me. I'd be like, oh, up, 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 done. But I, and it was really selective and it wasn't really clear on what it was being said. I will cut you with a katana if you move. That was, yeah, written on it. Start my key. The start time is my key. What's start time? Does uh, cause people per <sighs> dilate tonight from blood loss due to serial career was grasping on a kitchen knife. Hey, it's that guy who killed himself! I assume this was cause of neck wound, possibly suicide wound angle suspicious, sent a second floor dream for failure. Have you seen a proof of defense? Have not notified police, however, for future necessity, leave it this bad effect in direct room M4. Didn't say what the start time was though. Who would have such a dumb thing tattooed on their arm? Doesn't have a start time though. Hold on. Why would you have that tattooed? Oops, no, I actually wanted to read that. All right. The start time is my key. I assume they do not mean the start time of this game. I didn't say a start time. Oh, that's right, it's the nurse. Right, let's see if I can play this right. Let's see if I can play this right. Three, two. Now. Damn it. I'm sorry, did someone just shoot a gun at me? You have a gun?! You have a gun, motherfucker! You have a piece of shit! You have a gun?! Oh my goodness! Ah. I'll try something. Lock, bitch. Of course I can't get your ammo or the gun. The fuck was that? The fuck? You better fucking 
Shut the fuck up. Nurses have guns here. Put a fucking gun? Put a fucking gun? Alright, so it said the start time. Oh my goodness! Fucking Stanley! There was a tattoo guy in the room, not anymore though. That alarm clock at Filthy Bag are his. Ah, but don't Mr. Sand, I haven't done a thing. I didn't hate him, though. He was a liar. Shall I write something on my own? On my chest, since I can't cut open to show you my heart, I love Heather. You know something a bit more forceful? I love Heather is enough for what I feel, what a tender emotion this image brings. Fuck you! Okay, okay, okay. So, everyone, how do you read a clock? Six. No, okay, so it's six, and it's on its way to the next one. So what is that? 41? 641? Hopefully. 0641? Heather gets a game thinks it only makes sense for nurses to get guns. Yeah, fair enough. Case is locked. Uh, why would you have the answer? What? It's, it's zero. It's six forty-five. Was that the eight? Okay, fine. Maybe it's eighteen. There you go. I got an instant camera. The fuck is an instant camera good for? I'm like, no, you can see the developed photos far away. I don't know what I'd use it for, but I have it. Yeah, right when you typed it, I was like, oh, I'll just do military time then. Fuck you, Stanley. Piece of just absolute. Fucking creep. Alright, um. number of rooms that are just filled with nurses and they're like yeah we just put three of them in here for you cuz why the fuck not we thought it'd be funny honestly all right so what can I do with a camera what can I do what can I do with a camera what can I do with a camera hmm hmm With a camera. What said the Nito Begito thing was that I. Okay. The Nito Begito thing was that it could, like, see stuff that was far away, right? But I don't really. You can get that glued on key. What do, you, what do you mean? How how would the nail polish help with that? Because it said I could only nail polish was to remove nails. Did they lie to me? Did did they did they did they, did they lie to me? Why would they lie to me? Did they just get really uncomfortably close to the microphone? Why would they lie? To me? Like seriously, is that it? Oh, my bad. I misread. Right away. Apologies. How's that gonna help us with the glue? How's, how's that gonna... I mean, unless the nail polish works, but... If it's... I don't think nail polish works on glue. Unless it suddenly does, in which case... Weird. Why would nail polish remover work on glue? That's bullshit. 
That's bullshit. Yeah, blue shit in the wall and stuff. Fuck. Okay, but back in okay there. Gotta play fatal frame real quick, don't mind me. Start taking pictures of everything. I want everyone to know I do like the puzzles in this game. I think they're really fun and cool. But my goodness, every now and then the game just kind of does something stupid. That, like, they'll hand you an item and they'll be like, This item! What is But, um, no, I think the thing that bothers me is that, like, oh, good. I'll just take this. Thank you. Will I use it? No clue, but it's mine now. I own it. As if someone was just there. Shall be there. Reach around. Did I get rid of the camera? Was that its only purpose? I don't have the note with me. I assume it's in my memos. Fuck you, Stanley. Oh, that's right. Uh, yeah. Corpse tattoo. Photo backside of shelf. Yep. Uh. I mean, I felt I felt clever there. I, I felt like I, I had a good idea, like, right from the get-go. Like, oh, if it's this, then I'll do this. I, I felt pretty smart. Personally, you know. Oh, oops. Oh, camera. Camera. There. Okay. No. Oh. oh, Max, if you had tank controls, it wouldn't do that. Yeah, I agree. Let's use the camera to... Oh, yeah, that's right. I don't have a camera anymore. Apparently, it's only good for one photo. If you if you fuck up, you fucked up. Simple as that. I had a thought earlier, then I lost it. What was it? Oh, I like the puzzles in this game, but they sometimes do a really bad... Or, like, this game series in general, I should say. But sometimes it really does run into this issue of, like... They get, she has a gun, by the way. Just want everyone to know that. Just want everyone to be aware that she does, in fact, have a gun. See, now that she has a gun, I feel fear. Before, I had a gun, so they felt fear. What was that? But, um... No, like, so sometimes I feel like they give you a lot of information, and a lot of the information is absolutely useless. So, that, so there's, like... There's always that confusing moment of, like, what's important and what isn't. You know what I mean? And I, I run into that with this game series a lot. And I don't know if that's just me thinking too hard or what. But it, it kind of makes me feel a little dim. But I mean, hey, that's like that's the point of the puzzles, right?
Oh, I'm, I'm sorry. Punishment for brutality towards patient. That would suggest it's not the patient. It's the nurses. 12 hours confinement in the special treatment room. What the fuck? Dismissal policy no longer in effect. Contact the chief if you have any questions. There's something handwritten on the top of the typewritten sentence. The trick is not to leave any marks. And one other thing, this looks like it was written by a different person. The chief is a pervert. Christy would have been better off if she had been fired. <sighs> well, that... Wasn't one of these, like, broken open? I thought. I didn't want to go in. Fuck my life. I'm trapped in here, aren't I? Just a note that says, like, that's pretty dumb that you closed the door behind you. Flying freely, your ebony hair like the night sky. My hair is in ebony. Thank you very much. It is dirty blonde. <laughs> Eric, a great poet who conveys my feelings so well. I should have, oh, I should have let this place get to me. Neither should have gone crazy, but it's superbly enjoyable to draw my love for you. But why won't you accept proof of my love? Don't stand on ceremony. Now, after all, you and I exist is one. What I give to you is the same as what I give to me. Fuck, I'm stuck in here. Here we go. Shit. Ow. Thing special, but I guess it wasn't. So that was the point of that. Yeah, the trick is not to leave any marks. What kind of fucked up place is this? I forgot what the number was. What was it? 1472? Right? Nope, sorry, I didn't need the, the memos. There we go. Okay. Uh, just like what he says here. Oh, 1437. 1437. My bad. I had that a little jumbled. You can also visit the roof. I should visit the roof. One, four, three, seven. Seven, three, four. So it's okay. Six four three. That was a six. Ah, it is a s ow. It's a weak ass six. Yeah, that that was mm. Hmm. Hmm. The six. Getting hung up on little shit like that. Like, I I would have circled for a while and be like, huh, this number's not working. Maybe yeah, I need this number for a separate whatever. But no, it was just a week. Oh my goodness! I don't like this guy. He You're a bad. Oh. You're a bad. I got some machine gun. You're still a bitch. Up here. Hey, this part was broken. What the fuck? Oh, is that it? Is that all that's here? Yeah, there should have been like part of the fence was broken because 
fucking pyramid head threw me through it. I'm, I remember that distinctly. Well, thank you for telling me that. Some ammo in that Stanley note. I just, I, 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 would everyone like to hear a fun fact? I fucking hate Stanley, okay? Like, like, okay, it's one, th it's always, like, really creepy when there's, like, when there's something that's, like, stalking you because it's hungry versus stalking you because it hates you versus stalking you because it takes, like, pleasure in your pain. But there's an extra special level of scary for something stalking you because it loves you. That is horrifying. Ah, oh, here we go. Which one of these is got Maria? Oh. Fantastic. I found Maria. Uh, tissue and an alarm clock. The clock's from Brooklyn. No big deal. So just some kind of cop. Teaching despair. With Stanley, a succubus like Maria. She, you fucking incubus. Right? Incubus is the male version. Ha Hope House is managed by the Sign Hill Smile Sports Society, a charity organization called 4S. It's true that 4S is a well-respected charity that takes in poor children without homes and raises them with hope. Hires the heathen organization that teaches his own warped dogma in lieu of good religious values. Mr. Smith, Tap who lives near. So I'm sure I went there to complain one time, but they ran me out. Since then, I had to change the bed. In fact, I reported to you. Use tissues. Uh, then you read, and the guy who wrote it play a bigger role in SH4. Again! Jerky. Man, like all of these are broken. See, but oh god, he broke his toy. Oh no, oh, no. When they talk about the orphanage, all right, okay. Oh, oh no. I um because. Weren't for his medley, I would have been able to meet you in just a little while. Then I could have taken you to my world. Uh, world for us alone, more beautiful. <laughs> I'd see, they'd save me today. Heather, watch out for him. Leon Leonardo is no ordinary guy. Watch Le what is it? Leonardo Leon Leonard. Watch Leonardo be super chill. Farewell. I loved you, Heather. My goddess, Heather. My Heather. My. You know what? Whoa, that scared me. Oh, that scared the shit out of me. Oh, that got me. That is a lot of nurses. But I still got I still need to check out 10, 11, and 12 just to be sure. Hello? Hello? Claudia? No, I'm not... Don't lie to me, Claudia. I'm not Claudia. I'm always trying to run from your responsibilities. Actually, yes, I am Claudia. I apologize. 
I am Claudia. You still don't realize how foolish you've been. I'm so Ladia. The salvation of all mankind. Thank you, unknown Come. voice, who I assume what is Leonard. Ridiculous dream. Wait, just listen to me for a second. I've heard enough from you already. How did you <laughs> Moshi Moshi. Where did I go wrong? Listen to me already. <laughs> Moshi Moshi. I'm not Claudia. You're not Claudia? My name is Heather. <laughs> Heather. Who are you? Please tell me you're the guy who killed Stanley. Leonard Wolf. I like you, Leonard. I'm sorry. Leonard, I, I think you you're a cool daughter. guy. Let's talk. Man, this is a really ominous sounding dial tone. Claudia is your daughter? Man, she's a bitch, am I right? Oh, so you know her, do you? Yeah, she's trying to ruin my life. Are you one of her followers? No, I no, want to... Oh, I'm, fo I'm following her, all when right. I find her, I'm... Oh, I can feel the hatred. What? Behind your words. The he anger. fucking killed my dad! You plan to kill her, don't you? Uh, yeah. I I'm sorry. She, Maybe I'm doing it out of sadness, not hatred. Do you ever consider she that? She killed my father. She's a fool. But she's still my daughter. Nah, I'm fucking killing your daughter. I was going to forgive her if she changed her ways. I don't know. She kind of caused death. But I see it's too late. Yeah, we should kill her. Want to help me out? Heather, will you help me? Will you help, help me? You? I'm locked up in here. I trust you. I must stop Claudia. I'm, I'm Where are you now? Uh, I'm not sure myself. But the door is at the end of the hall on the second floor. What? I think I can be of help to you. Well, if you're not sure yourself, then how do you know that? A seal. Please. I don't know what a seal is. A seal? It's a Pokemon. It was the most laziestly named Pokemon. How'd you get a phone? The end of the hall on the second floor. You wanna kill your daughter? I'm, okay, as long as that guy is the reason Stanley is fucking dead, I am so cool with it. Wait, the end of the hall on the second floor? Sorry, I've been holding back a sneeze right now. But, we already checked that. We still gotta check. Okay, okay. Alright, so here's the plan. Oh. There we go. I messed up doing that with my tongue towards a bit. Bitch! Oh! Bitch! You're all catching this! Oh my god, that was horrifying. Shit! Made the music stop. But what do you mean? Check the. What do you mean check the floor again? Like. I think it was that gun only did like two drinks worth. Uh, check the check the floor again. Where? Like, what? What do you? The second floor, like the caller said. Oh. Oh. Okay. I can do that. Yeah, sure. Probably switch back to the gun that has more ammo. Yeah, I, I used it. Ooh, ooh, tasty. Thank you. Wait, I, I can equip supplies. What do I have? Like a use supply button. Cool. Nope. Nope. Man, I'm so cool. I am so unbelievably cool with the prospect of Stanley being dead. I don't know if I can emphasize that enough. Like, I'm so happy that guy is dead. Like, fuck that guy, frankly. The guy 
set a key code to essentially him fantasizing about ripping off my face in horrible ways. What am I looking at? Oh, I'm looking at the same thing. Yeah, the guy literally set a key code to a, a, a short story of him killing me in the most brutally horrible way possible. I feel no obligation to feel any kindness for him. Uh, I would like to, I'd like to leave. Open the door. Thank you. Wait, hold on. Is there a... Okay. Okay, cool. Alright, cool. So, now I have this elevator that I don't recall having before. Did I have this elevator before? I did have this elevator before. This... Yeah. I'll take the stairs because it's good to get my get my 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 cardio in. Not a bit cardio. Okay. Actually, real quick, since I I got a feeling in my gut that something big and scary is gonna happen. Let's take now as a small bathroom break. Just real quick, everyone go to the bathroom, get some water. Uh, hey, Silent Hill for the room installed. Good shit. All right, cool. Yeah, let's all take a quick bathroom break, and we'll be right. Let me just grab my mic. Let me. There you go. All right. We all got some water. We all got to go to the bathroom. We are good to go, as far as I'm concerned. Let's go talk to Leonard. Leonard, who, as far as I'm concerned, has already proved himself to be a kind of. Leonard, who has already proved himself to be a pretty cool guy, I feel like. You know, I'm already kind of, kind of cool with him. Hey, would you look at that? We'll start with the pistol. We'll start with the pistol.
I'm sorry, is that a door? Oh, look, that door isn't on your map. Is this real? Is this real or is this an illusion? Okay, this is game three for three where you're making me ask that question over and over again. Is this real? That yeah, one's back there, you better fuck off. It's getting close behind me. That make me feel very good about my life right now, you know. Not really. Not really. You know. Look, if you're gonna just do this... Look, if you're gonna do something dramatic, you might... Just open the damn door. Fucking, just so you know, the first thing I see, if it scares me, I'm shooting it, okay? Like, I just want to get that out of the way. This isn't going to be, you know, you say oobagoo and then I get you. No, this is going to be you say oobagoo and I shoot your face. Face. I'm gonna shoot your face. You're not gonna appreciate it. You're locking my camera angle. You're locking my camera angle. Yep. Yep. You're locking my camera angle. Me and my cute boots are gonna fucking shoot you. Yep. Now I've lost track of which way I came from. This is even worse because we're on the second floor. You know what I mean? Like, so something has to be below us. Okay. Well, that was unsettling. Oh my goodness! I play my I second one. I I the third one. You baby, or double four. Oh, what is for me, double five? Oh, you know, double six. You're symbolic, double seven. Good shit. This one doesn't make my head hurt when I look at it, but I know this one, it must be. Oh my gosh, it's that one video. It's that one video from. Is it the first. Is it, yeah! That was her talking about a lesson, the Satan child, right? Uh, no, it was more like watching a video in a dark room with that nurse. I know her, Lisa, who is so heavy, who is so heavenly toward me in that hellish hospital room. Fuck, she get a little weird though. Kind of hope it. Wait a second, the door. We all need to make a decision right now. What's real and what's not. Because I'm starting to think none of this is real. And I'm just going insane. 
I don't got time for your dumbass Satan worshiping cult motherfucking bullshit over here. I'm gonna shoot. I just want everyone to know, for the record, if you scare me, I'm shooting you. What do you mean, what's floating there? Like, what? Like, oh you, oh, you mean on the way up? You mean that body? My wa wand, my wonderful hell, my one deter face. Why no no one? I'm having a hard time re. Uh, is it this armless creature? No, it has arms. It's messy with things. Excuse me. I hope you don't mind. It just. You're weird. You're kind of defying gravity a little bit, honestly. I don't think it really works this way. Also, the effect is this thing. Can you tell me, mister? Uh, it says, what a wonderful... I think it's wonderful. What a wonderful world. Is that it? What a wonderful world. No, after it. But you're a creepy man defying gravity. You're twisting shit. I don't like it. Uh, I'm kind of having... It's a mannequin. No, that's a nurse. That is a nurse. She is very dead, and from the looks of it, she is showing some side boob and is covering herself in blood. Almost like the little window, like a little windows. No, it. No, after it's Lisa. But her hair's not the right color. That's not Lisa. Her hair's not the right color. What the fuck? Like that? That's no. no. Or people suspect it is. It's one of the, that's one of the nurses. That's the same haircut the nurses had. So this one doesn't have arms. Or if it does, it's kind of hard to see it. I I can't see what this rain is either. This way, I guess. But it, it was one of the nurses. They all had the black bob. Is it called a bob pet? I don't know. I think I need to get my prescription fixed. Maybe it was being carried in. Maybe we just wasn't on top of the in here. What the f I don't even try. I like to avoid touching this kind of thing. There's something on the ground. It's gonna do something to me. Directions. I can hardly see 
if something moves, I'm gonna shoot. Don't start making noises, by the way. You know, for that part of the quest that we're gonna need a lot of blood. yet that I really genuinely dislike how loud each step is. Not in like a game design way. Oh great. Oh. Uh why didn't that why didn't that shoot Great so the sub machine gun's worthless on small targets. Please open the door back up. Said she didn't like mirrors. She, yeah. <gasps> Shot. Real quick, am I gonna die if I stay in here? Because I am too enraptured by what's going on. Am I gonna die? <gasps> you ready to get fucking dunked on? Can't leave the room at first, but you can eventually. Wait, the room drains my health slowly? Huh? Oh shit. Saw that problem right there. Well, that was fucking horrifying! But hey, everything's fine now. That was horrifying and I loved it. Oh, these things are not horrifying and I hate them. I thought you hate them. Start over. Was there a puzzle? Yeah, one of the best moments in the series is that mirror room. Oh, God. and it just froze. It's making that noise. Wait, 
Wait a second. Do I have a beach on me? Very well done and very creepy. I loved it. Alright, um. Don't have a key or anything, so I guess we'll just go to. Actually, no, have we gone to the roof? Although, I think I talked. Okay, I talked about something to a friend once. Oh. I talked about something to a friend once, I remember, and we were just. It was the friend that I played Fatal Frame 2 with that um, things that I wish the game did more of was moments that are meant to freak you out and fuck with you for no... There's a bit of foreshadowing for later on. I mean, the blood was like... Oh, we can't. We can't worry about that. The blood, like, it was all around and then it went away and then it came onto me and then, like, I froze in my position and... Oh, that was so creepy, but it was cool. It was super cool. That's a whole thing. But um, something that you can use it. You can use the elevator. Yep, that's where I was. That that that's where I was heading to. Next. But something that I absolutely loved when I played Fail Frame Two was um, was the times the game would fuck with you just for fun there was nothing there was nothing mechanically trying to kill you there was nothing going on it was just we're gonna fuck with you now because it's scary as shit and the few times it did that I absolutely loved it like of course I freaked out in the moment but then immediately afterwards I was like that was fucking amazing I loved it so moments like that I am a huge fan of like You know, those moments that just kind of make you stop and go like, what the fuck? That was really cool. There's no door here. Yeah, the blood is first on the floor and comes to the sink that goes on mirrors and fills the room on your side. Yeah. See, I was, I was expecting there to like, I was expecting like a monster or something to come. But like I could only see it in the mirror or vice versa. I can't quite tell what's going on there, but I see Lisa's smile again. That's not too good. Yeah, like, I think that's something that I've really enjoyed. That's something I've been really enjoying, I think. They made me press the button. That or is just conveniently timed. But yeah, like just weird moments that scare you for no reason, I think are really fun. And of course, if it's done too much, you know, it becomes overdone and then they're not scary anymore. But man, they, they've been nailing them. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear. Oh, I forgot your name. Who are you? Oh, okay, thanks. Happy birthday, dear. Who are you? Happy birthday to you. Happy 31st birthday. Is this Leonard? That's the murder. 
murderous name. Not my name. I'm not your beloved Stanley either. Thank God. He's underground now. Fuck. His new name is number seven. I hate him. <laughs> What's your name? Oh, but don't worry about that now. It's time to celebrate your birthday. He's doing a great job. You've got me mistaken for someone else. I'm Today's not mistaken. Not... Today is your 24th birthday. You said 31st. You said it was 31st. For you. Which do you prefer? To give pain or to receive it? You can have the one you hate the most. <laughs> Happy birthday to you. But you're wrong. It's not my birthday. It's not my birthday. I'm not 24. I'm not 31. And Stanley isn't beloved. How old was Cheryl in SH1? She was like seven and a half. Wait. Now it's 17 years ago. No, wait, hang, hang on, hang on. If Cheryl was like seven or eight or something, and that was seven, this is seven, that was 17 years ago, that means she's 24. Ooh. But he said, but 20 for Sarah's. Said, wait, hold on. Sorry, d am I misremembering? He said thirty first birthday and then twenty fourth birthday or twenty four years. Like I, I, I um, I, I messed that up. Oh my goodness, is Claudia Cheryl? Claudia Cheryl, son of a bitch. And okay, yeah, sure. If that guy was really channeling the the Joker, I'm totally down for it. That was creepy as shit. That was really good. Since Heather is 17, Cheryl will be 24 and 31 if Lester was alive. I can't see over there, so I'm just gonna. I don't know what I just grabbed. I I uh, what did I? Uh, did I hit the wrong button? And 31 if Lester was alive. Now. I hate it. Guess who that is? That's us. Yeah. Did they are. They already hit. They already hinted that. Yeah. That, that it's us. So. Fuck that thing. Fuck that thing. Fuck that thing. That's what the. Son of a bitch. Son of a bitch. I think we're gonna leave here. Yeah, that's what that's what the one thing we're talking about. That's like he got a baby and he was like, "Fuck, I don't know what to do with this baby, but you know maybe I should just kill it because it's evil." And he's like, "No, wait, no, it's it's a, it's a baby. It has done no wrong. I will love it. And I will act as a father to it." So. Wait, hold on. Okay, am I am I misremembering? He said happy thirty first birthday, and then he said happy twenty fourth birthday. So what you're saying is that Alessa would be thirty one, right? And that Cheryl and that Cheryl would be twenty four because it's been seventeen years since if either of them were alive. 
So he was saying happy birthday to both of us. Because if I'm the fusion or whatever, if I'm the fusion or whatever of both, his unnecessary people. Oh, this kind of decision that I fight as a knight of honor, as a protector of the seal, I sacrifice myself to the blood of criminals. What? I see this and I want to ask him, so you think you're one of the necessary ones, but it seems like I've heard this protected the seal business somewhere before. Hi. <laughs> Just checking your hitboxes. That's always the fun thing whenever people talk about, like, we need a purge of the human race or, like... You know, the people that are like, oh, it'd, it'd be so great if, like, you know, people on Earth would die so that others could have their resources or, like... You know, there's so many unnecessary or dumb people in the world. Every person who says that, they always count themselves as those that are the necessary and the smart and the elite and the worthy of living. No one's ever willing to... Yeah, fuck these things. No one's ever willing to go, hey, I'll be the one that dies so that other may live. No, no. It's always other people who need to... Die. Lovely. Which is how you know it's bullshit. You know, if, if, if you think humanity is bullshit. You know, if you think humanity is an absolute scummy virus of the world that'd be better off dead, then start with yourself. What? Sorry, that's me getting kind of dark. Yeah. Because, you know, it's people like, oh, yeah, we're the chosen ones. Right, you're the chosen ones. It's always whatever group lives, you want to be a part of it. Dr. Midkiff. Please use extra caution with the patient room 312. What was in 312 in the last game? He should, he should still have his religious freedom here in the hospital, but he shouldn't push his faith on others. I'm a victim, too. Rumor has he got here by stabbing someone over a religious dispute. Please be careful. R. Crosby. Looks like the rumor is true. According to the head nurse, I do think he's a good person. I though, easy to deal with. Cults love purge in the human race. Yeah. And that's, my, and that's me also talking about, like, no one likes cults. That's me also talking about, like, crazy environmentalists. Of course it's F. Thanks. She's got a gun. I just realized I don't actually know where to go next. Now hang on, actually, hold on, stop and think about this for a second. I go to the basement. Maybe the basement has something. I'll let Molly out. Yeah. Yeah, let's go with it. Yeah, sorry. That that's my mini rant whenever people are like, oh I wish more people on earth would just die or that like humanity is a purge and screw them that so oh I just realized based on one, two, three. Of course, the lowest one. But I like that. That that kind of stuff always bugs me, just because it's never humanity should die, and I'll be the first to go as a martyr to the cause to show. Oh, oh, oh! That's why I'm looking at number seven. Oh. Wait, what? 
the wits whispering love songs into your while cruel Lynette wants. He seeks out her soul by his own black ambition, frightening her out of her wits, whispering love songs into your ear while cruel in it. There's a memo here. Oh. Is that memo the the note? Someone was making noise. That's I'm pretty sure these things are nailed they are, they're nailed on. The grass the thrush so loved to eat gave him sweet happiness. He sank ever deeper and finally felt the destruction of failed distress. That doesn't mean anything. What the fuck? Who killed Cock Robin the sparrow? They said he wants them all dead to him. Honey sweet is their sobbing. Thank goodness Stanley's fucking dead. Cock Robin who hid the key away is ash in the oven, all right? The place he held is empty now and the doors remain shut tight. And yes, yeah, so I did hear them a little bit. I, I did hear them a little bit, yeah. Yeah, good. Fuck him. The black rook is the praying sword who hears the god in the skies. His whisper petitions go on without end and glassy and dimmer his eyes. It's just a lot of creepy poem. Feel creepy. I like it. The lark's lost, the uh, child lost all his words and walled himself up all away. Heart and mouth were locked up tight in a cage where none want to stay. The wren with pure heart as yet refined makes us laugh with his feeble lip smack. But still we all know he shall never grow and he knows not much how he is lacking. The kite, hot, crazy, and panty mad, sweet shackles that tease and excite. Death itself would drive him wild where blood that turns milky The dove's hope died, he chose his path, his flapping wings fell still. Drenched in scarlet, here they lay, his cheeks pale white and chill. The owl who forgot the sky, resigned to his poor earthbound state. Hungry or full, didn't matter at all, he ate and he ate and he ate. Does that really sense? Oh my goodness. Here we go. Alright, burn the one who knows of death, pure adored by those above. No prayers within, just simple love. That's probably going to be seven. And now the pining hunter, the flames longing for his rebirth, a distant breath within the earth. I'll get it. I assume that's a phoenix of some kind. Or that one that wasn't on the body. Burn up that heavy body of his, make it wine, dancing in the sky, that bombless gut, now a cloud, now not a sigh. Uh, d uh, that was the owl. That is the owl. Definitely that is the owl. Right? Okay, so we got... Okay. The sweet blood on his laughing lips, now calling to the gates of hell, these burns evermore, that soulless shell. Okay, one of them was laughing. Four bodies return to ashes, thus the doors open, thus the doors open. Okay. Okay, let's just read the first one. Burn the one who knows no death, pure adorned by those above. No prayers within, just simple love. Okay, cool. So simple love, I'm guessing, is this one. Uh, right? Simple love. Actually, it could be this one. That could that could be it. Could be three. Okay, well, let's let's stick with three. Okay, that one's nothing. Straight up, that one's nothing. Um, I assume that's the one in there right now. So, okay, I'm going to say three. It's not that one? What the fuck? Oh, wait. But still, we all know he shall never grow old, and he knows not how much he is lacking. That sounds like an immortality. Okay, fine. So if it's not that one, it's nine. If it's not three, it's nine. See, let me, let me, let me try a little bit. Jeez. Uh... Never grow old. Yep. 
getting, I'm getting, I'm getting there. Jesus, hang on. Yeah, the owl is definitely the one that's like glutton. Okay, hold on. Okay, hold on. So, so burn the one who knows no death. So nine. Now the pining hunter, the flames longing for his rebirth, the distant breath within the earth. Okay, we don't know that one. Burn up the heavy body of his, make it wine, dance in the sky. That bomb was gut. Now a cloud, now a sigh. Okay, that is definitely the owl. Hey, I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna open a, I'm gonna open a sticky note real quick. So, so nine. Something, 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 something. Okay, there we go. Okay, the sweet blood in his laughing lips now calls him to the gate that burns evermore. Uh, oh, there's, there's four. Okay, so. Okay, so which one's the owl? So the owl is two, right? Yeah, so owl is definitely that, like, second one. Okay. Right, so there's four bodies, so we have. So. Burn the one who knows no death, pure adored by those above. So, yeah, that's nine. And uh, now the pining hunter. So we need to find a hunter. And the sweet blood on his laughing lips now calls them to the gates of hell that burns. Okay, so. A uh, pining hunter, the flames longing for his birth that distance in the earth. The sweet blood on his laughing lips now calls them to the gates of hell that burns evermore. That soul is shut. Okay, so. The hunter. Yeah, not that one. Laughing lips strikes <laughs> that that strikes me as What do you mean the third verse is not the owl? What the fuck? How is that not the owl? The owl was a glutton. Straight up said the owl forgot the sky. Resigned to his poor son. Hunger full didn't matter all he ate and he ate and he ate. He's, he's the only one that's mentioned food. What are you doing now? He's the only one that's mentioned food. Wait, hold on. I saw his words while well, so followed by a heart and mouth both locked up tight in the kitchen. You gotta find someone who's like, who... You gotta find the... Uh, is the praying sort... Yeah, which one's the hunter? This one could be the hunter. I, I'd buy that. I'd buy that if, if that was the hunter. Okay, right, cool. Um, I don't think. Because it's not the owl. Maybe it's this one. I feel like it could be the owl. Um, this one could be it, too. So you're one. Okay, cool. Okay, okay, okay. okay. Give, me, give me the lock, give me the lock. Okay, so... So it strikes me that it should be... Oh. So nine... Seven... Two... Zero. No. Three. Zero. Nope. One... Three. No. Burn the one who knows that death pure adored by those who have no prayers within, just simple love. That knows, that knows no death. Alright. Just simple love. He shall never grow old. That makes sense to me. And now the pining hunter, the flames longing for his rebirth, the distant breath within the earth. Okay, we'll skip that one. Burn up that heavy body of his, make it wind dancing in the sky. That bottomless gut, now a cloud, now a sigh. Ah, uh... that's why he's pining. Ah. Uh... I feel like that's a little misleading. I feel like a little bit. Yeah, hold on. Two. What? What the fuck? No, okay, that's fine. Hang on, okay. 
Okay, so. Uh, nah, nah. Okay, burn up the heavy body of his, make it wind dancing in the sky. That bottomless gut, now a cloud, now a sigh. Now a uh, Okay, so. Bottomless, bottomless gut, so it's not the owl. Uh, um. Nancy's shop has a 260 side deck. It's like a yeah, that might be seven. That might be seven, actually. Okay. Uh, no. Uh, I think it's seven. That No, no, that's no, that's dumb. That doesn't make sense. That the Oh, honey, sweet is their sobbing. That's why he hunts people. That's bullshit. That is that is dumb. I don't like that at all. That's mm. the uh. I'm gonna kill Cock Robin. That I don't. I don't like that. I I don't. Wait, I equip it. What the fuck? Um, I'm starting not to like the puzzles on hard because they're not so much hard puzzles so much as they're we're going to mislead and lie to you a little bit. Also, my dog is barking. Hang on. Jenna. Jenna. Jenna, come on. She's like totally chill until Ann goes to bed. I, Jenna, Molly, come on. Please don't do that way. Never mind. She's not coming. Except she's going to start barking loudly, but it's fine. All right. Yeah, that wasn't... You can play this game on a hard rules without the internet. Yeah. Wait, hold on. Where does the creamy go? I'm just going to go to the first floor just for sake of, like, looking at the map and then we can figure out where to go from there. But, yeah, like, what the fuck? Because like... there was multiple of those answers that's like, oh, it's clearly this. And it's like, oh, no, it's not this. Well, why not? It should be. And they're like, nope, it's not. Anyways, I think we figured out what room it is. It's that one at the bottom. That's dumb. I feel like you shouldn't give a kid this game, period, but, you know, that's, a, that's a, another matter. At least wait till they're deep. I can't see shit. I can't see what I'm doing. I 
don't want to kill this thing. Maybe I should kill it just to get out of my system. Am I hitting it? Get oh my goodness, this thing is so dumb. There's two, isn't there? There he is. That thing is, those things are so freaking stupid. I don't want to use my gun. And I can't see them. Come on. Oh my goodness. Oh, okay. That is really frustrating. That is extremely frustrating. And like, you can't see them. Try to pull off the shoes and check. <laughs> Thanks, I had it. 38th birthday? You can enter soon if you answer the birthday phone call. It has some presents. 14 plus 7 plus 17. It's not my birthday. Wait, I don't get it. Was, was that the... Didn't really need the stuff for anyone to give it to me. That weirdo, I mean. That was the presents? That's it? I mean... Yeah, gift horse to the mouth, but also... That's it? Fuck these things, they're the worst. Oh my goodness. I am shooting you so I have to reload. Fuck that thing. On how much you have already. The less you have, the more you got. Oh, that's nice. Except, well, you can have whichever one you hate the most. So, what was it like? Were there always the three nurses in there? Can't bear to check and let me make a bed. Close the door. So, yeah, in that case, he didn't give me. So, yeah, yeah, pretty much in the color acting. <laughs> I mean, come on, it's fun. Do they ever explain? Well, I guess I shouldn't ask if they ever explain what the. All right, let's take a look-see. There's a stretcher here. Not just you, this is more like an altar of some sort. The candles, the knife, and this athletic smell. Do they worship the picture or something in the picture? I mean, I ain't... I ain't cut myself. Uh, die now, the money is that of the ritual sacrifice. There's a reason! 
Testament! The New Testament! Offering uh, prayers, pierce a man's chest with a copper stick, and drench the altar in the load of parts of heart to praise and to show love to God. Once again! <laughs> Another sacrificial rite mentioned in the same book, the victim is burned alive. Oh, God! Uh, being a sun god, even though this village is close to redemption, it brings to mind a dark cultish history. Yeah, with it saying th like 31 and then all that, that really is like, yeah, adding together all the numbers and just being like, what the hell? All right, well, I don't know what to do. Giant salt and the blood which spouts red from pretty much says what you need. Wait a second. D don't I have... Well, okay, so... That's right, there was a bucket of blood. So, oh, the plastic bag. I have a plastic bag. Ew. Where's the guy with the bucket? Where's the guy? Yep, there it is, examining room. Okay, yep, yep, okay. Yep, okay. Oh, oops. This is gross as shit, and I don't like it. God, you're giving me the answers to crazy silence. Yeah, let me think about it for a little bit. Unless you're like... Unless it's you going like, oh my goodness, you'll think about this forever. God, 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 give me a second, man. Jeez. Okay, um... Oh, great. Now she's going to shoot me all the way down. Fuck you. What? <laughs> what floor was that on? I already forgot. Third? Third. Right? Third? Yep, number three. Yep, number three. I love that they actually show me like going up the elevator like the proper distance. I think that's really cool. Well, of course, I need to help. Okay, I want you to know I really do appreciate it that you're helping me out with this. It's just that yeah. give, give, give me a chance, give me a chance, man. Like it, it's not me trying to be ungrateful. It's just like, well, hang on, I need to think about it. Whoa, whoa! No, that's right, I gotta. I just realized if I could pierce the heart. I did pierce. Yep. Okay, hold on, hold on. Hold on, so this. With blood. Did I like? I wonder what's up to this perfume. Let's see, um, okay, so let me let me totally go back on the statement that I made earlier. Uh, the thing I made earlier. Is there? Did I already miss the thing that I could do with the um, with the perfume bottle? Like, did I already miss my opportunity there? Or,
But, um, did I already miss whatever opportunity I had with the elevator? Or, sorry, with the perfume? Or is that kosher? Like, am I going to use it in the future? Kind of a thing. Because I've had that sucker for a while. I don't know what to do with it. <laughs> Knowing this game, it'll probably be the one thing that's, like, absolutely required later. Oh, I died with one. Okay, actually, I don't mind the nurses, to be completely honest. Thanks for saving me from the gun, I guess. Fuck my life. Oh my goodness. If I die by those things, I'm gonna be so mad. Oh god, I hate those things. Okay, um. Uh... How hurt am I? Do you want me to spoil what the perfume does? It's not required and you can't use it for anything. If it's too late, if it's too late and it doesn't matter anymore, yes. It does explain what it does in this game. In this game. Yeah, like, yeah, if, if it's something that we can't do anything with it and it's too late and it doesn't matter, then I'm cool with you telling me. But... If not, then, like, if it's still something we could use, then I would rather not know until it's time. Also, I'm doing a pag and all. Hey, it's kind of like a heart. Kind of. Where did that come from? That wasn't there earlier. That was not... That... <sighs> Wait, what the... What? Okay, yeah, the definitely. What's the point of it, then? What? That makes no sense. It's on you for the rest of the game and you can't use it. What's the point of it? That's weird. Was it just to sit there and be like, woo, what does it do? Alright, um I'm getting kinda of sleepy, but this is this is I think once we solve whatever happens here, I think we'll be good. It's a troll item. Okay, let's go. Be in here. If you have it, especially nurses, nice. Yeah, Leonard, where are you? Thank you. Now I can finally leave here. Now Claudia's ridiculous dream is over. Well, I guess it's time to dispose of her. The salvation of all mankind. Come! Why must we reward even the unbelievers? Oh. What are you talking about? You don't about want our plans, of course. You don't want to it's share. It's true that God is merciful. But first, one must be chosen. I don't trust you, Calvinist. Only we who hearken to the voice of God will be given the keys to paradise. Don't you think so, Heather? Yeah, sure. This wire is dirty as Go shit. Go ahead and it. think whatever you want. What do you mean by that? 
I'm sassing you. I mean that I don't think the way you guys do. I am sassing you. I don't want any part of that kind of paradise. You're an unbeliever. You deceived me. I never said I was a believer. I didn't deceive you. We were both just wrong about each other. I thought you were a normal person. That's rude. So you tried to trick me. No. So you could run off with my seal, huh? I don't know what the seal Heretic. is. You planned to destroy God. I did. I told you I wasn't trying to trick anyone. What is this seal thing anyway? Oh, don't play innocent. You can't fool me anymore. I love the idea of me just being like, what the, the fuck seal is that? Yet? Is mine. I was what? appointed by God to be its God. That sounds great. Can we talk about it? The only thing you'll get from me is a gruesome death. That's very rude. Hi. Leonard, is that you? Death to all who turn their backs on God! How are you talking? <sighs> is every person here a mental case? <laughs> well, I guess you're not a person anyway. That's rude, but I love it. Oh no. Dude, it's just a seal chill. <laughs> the seal of God! He has like the Pokemon in his hands. But, sorry, that moment of sass or anything. Well, I guess you're not a person anyway. By the way. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh, he's swimming. He is swim swamming. Oh, gal. All right, where are you? Where are you, bitch? Oh, there you are. There you are. Oh, 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 oh. oh I'm sorry. You're still a god. I ain't gonna protect you from this, bitch. I'm gonna step on you. Oh, no. Yeah, you get the fuck back down here. Shit. Stop the shit out of you, like a sand mat, motherfucker. Hey, get over here. I'm having too much fun with this. Hold on. Is this a waste of ammo? Oh, you best believe it is, but also it's funny, so I'm gonna keep doing it. Oh, you're so big and scary. Look at you. Oh, no. I feel bad because there is a little bit of a delay, but I am doing exactly what you suggested. Matafada! Matafada, get over here! Hello! Stop on you! Oh, I'm stopping on you! Yeah, bitch, where you gonna, you gonna kick you in the shit? Seal of God, angel, motherfucker, unnecessary people in my ass! Get over here, bitch! Also, what's the point of these gears? They're not moving. Not, oh, they're not moving towards me. They're not exactly pushing me into it. Oh no, I'm about to... Oh no. Shit. Dramatic speech is very like handsome sounding boys yelling at me and everything. I'm just like, what if I just light you up? What if I just fucking light you up? Oh, that was good. Excellent. Beautiful. Leonard's not here anymore. Yeah, fuck Leonard. But hey, I he guess took... I should head back to the motel now. But hey, he took care of Stanley. Took care of Stanley. I hope Douglas is okay. He took care of Stanley. Stanley. Stanley's dead. Huh? Ah, oh, sick. I got a rock. Fuck yeah. What's this? Hey, it's kind of like that one save symbol. I got a talisman. What does the talisman do? Oh, I only have four bullets. Okay, fine. I guess I'll switch the pistol. I item has an old design. I got it after I defeated Leonard. Leonard is a bitch. 
He's a bitch. Can't believe he tied up Bug to that. Frickin'. Yeah, on the upside, he fucking killed Stanley, and I'm so glad that he did that, because fuck Stanley, frankly. And here's the okay, I was gonna say, here's the question game. Are you gonna. No, oh, okay. Are you gonna take me all the way back home, or are you gonna make me walk there? I mean, there's nothing else really for me to check. I'm. Why did you send her to my father? Was that wrong? It's your fault that he... But surely it's a good thing. It means he was one of God's beloved, no? I don't... Those who mock God will never receive salvation. You'll go to hell, Vincent. You'll never feel the joy... Of God's everlasting paradise. And you think God is going to save you? Huh. What do you know anyway? What if I just walk into the room? I know about the pleasures oh. of this world. The pleasures, like you know. And I want to find my happiness while I'm still here. Fornicating yourself with the rusty hospital, I guess. You hated your father. You're, Didn't you? I really don't like your facial expressions. I really don't. I saw the way he hit you. Kicked you. And made you cry. I get it. It's a PS2 game, but... Mm. Oh, the memory of his cruelty is forever burned into sibling. my mind. Well, if I just walk in and shoot you both. Yes. Yes. And that's why we need God. Just, just walk in and I'm like, fuck What you, you call fuck fate you. is nothing more than a child crying out for love. That's uh, why you're all alone. It's also because you murder people with flesh monsters and you're summoning another dimension. You don't powers. understand. None of you do. It, it's only him. Why are you talking to multiple? Also, how'd you both get in my hotel room? Get the fuck out of my hotel room. Well, let's go back to the hotel room. All right. Let's check out this way for funsies. Hopefully I find a leg monster. Yeah. You're all alone because it's a, it's a cry for love. Now, I think you're all alone because you're a fucking murderer that's summoning like literal hell to come and kill us. Yeah, I think when people ask yourself, uh, ask you, like, you know, why should I like you? I think that is not one of the reasons. Frankly, murder is bad. You killed my dad. Just to make me angry. The pleasures of this world. I assume he's talking about the other world, so the fuck pleasures of Seatalk. I say it's a bit him fornicating himself with, like, insert metal object, but that totally is what it is. I mean, what the fuck? So I'm like... Ah, it's just that fucking thing. Whatever. Yeah, fuck you. Okay, let's breathe in a little bit. Dodge me. That was totally on purpose. The camera's turning me all sorts of weird ways. I don't like it. Yeah, they're both in my hotel room. Let's see. Uh, yep, okay. Okay, that makes sense. 
this isn't it. Let's try it again. See, now everyone is stuck in here. <laughs> so, how did you both get in the hotel room? Where's Douglas? He went out. But, he left a message for you. I will shoot you in the leg. Was there someone else here just now? No, no. Just me. I would like to roll insight. Don't you want to know what the message is? Yeah. What did he say? Are you playing the music or is this Zabians? The church is on the other side of the lake. Church. I wonder what he meant by that. Oh my goodness, it's gonna be the church in the graveyard at the beginning of Silent Hill 2. Don't understand. That's where Claudia is. Across the lake. On the north side. Wait, no. If you're going, you'd better go through the amusement park. Of course. That's probably the only way in now. Of course it is. Go northwest on Nathan Avenue. It's a bit far, but it's closer than heaven. <laughs> oh, shoot. Is that it for the message? Uh huh. Give, give me a reason to shoot him, please. Fox. I'd like to save, because I want to end the episode. Douglas really said that? What's wrong? You don't trust me? I want to save. Oops. Can I, can I? You have to be sent us to the hospital. Eh. My controller is a little bit dead. Come on. Come on. Come on. There you go. Uh, wait, hold on. Okay, we. I, I was kind of hoping they let me save. But, um. I mean, on one side, we don't have any other leads, so I can't call him out on his bullshit. But on the other side. Fuck that guy. Of course, it's like, oh, you gotta freaking go through the amusement park because fuck you. Shit. There's a save in the hospital. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Hindsight. That speed limit sign looked like it was hand drawn. He's not Vincent Valentine. I want my edgelord back. I want my edgelord vampire werewolf boy back. He was the... I fucking loved Vincent then. This new Vincent sucks. He's a creepy person. I don't like him. He's closer than heaven. What does that even mean? It's like it's close to the death. Blah, blah, blah. It's like... Okay, okay, okay. Ah, oh, fucking course. Ah, oh, fucking course. It's back to the back to the beginning. Back to the beginning. Mm. Oh, great! Now I'm preggers. My stomach hurts. I really hope I'm not preggers. Actually, that that was a horrible. That was a, that was a, that was a joke in bad taste. I just assumed my stomach hurts, and they said I was kind of a baby, so, you know. What the fuck was oh, that? hell. It's closer to your eventual doom. <laughs> you imagine him just out of nowhere being like, mm -hmm. the quicker you go there, the quicker you'll die, Heather. <laughs> also, those bodies are totes gonna get up. Alright, cool. <gasps> last time, last time I came here, I also had a submachine gun. But not a katana! Heather ate a happy burger. Gave me the indigestion. <laughs> Alright, well, okay. Uh, 
Okay, well, uh, check that. Yep, there's the body in there. Yep, this is... Yep, it is... It is for Sherzy's. The same place. Is that thing's head always like that? Yeah, just checking. Alright, one more thing to check. I can't go over there. The thorough boys here. I'm gonna cut the shit out of you. Okay, I can't even do it to go to the bathroom. So, fair enough. This is... Can you imagine if you went to Disney World, this is what it looked like? Like, with all the grates and all, like, the weird boxes and shit. It's creepy as shit. Oh, hey, it's a dog again. Whoop! Hey, it's you again. Oh, look at that. Oh look, it's here again. This is where I played it last time. Except then I'm gonna have to go on the roller coaster, but I remember dying on the roller coaster. Yeah, the hat is the same as before. This door is busted. Yep. Oh. I know something's gotta be different. Like, something's gotta be different. I don't know what, though. Why would they... Kinda like that, actually. Nice! That was good. That was good. Yeah, I was gonna say, why would they, why would they let me into this area? Well, I guess just to be, like, foretelling of, like... The roller coaster, because this time I know about it, so we're able to jump. <sighs> Anyways, hum, I'm sleepy. Let's end the episode off here. We had a good time in Katanaville, USA. Anyway, so uh, next time we stream will be on Friday. We're gonna be back to Skyrim. Uh, we're gonna be who jump call? We're gonna be back to Skyrim. We're still doing the main quest line, so trying to figure out the Elder Scrolls. I think we just jump. We're jumping into Black Reach, which is. Horrible. I fucking hate Black Reach. Um, yeah, next time, and the next time we stream Silent Hill 3 will be next Monday. Assuming nothing happens, of which will be announced on Facebook and Twitter and Discord. I have a Discord. Fuck all if I know what to do with it, but I have a Discord. Um, the VODs will be put on YouTube someday. I'm not too worried about like getting it done immediately, but I'll, I'll work on it. Don't worry. I just have some other things I gotta take care of first. And yeah. Let's end the episode off here. Science Crab, thank you so much for helping me through stuff. I want you to know I really appreciate it. Yeah, it, it was a good time. I, I have been really enjoying myself with this game, even though I kind of get mad at it a lot of the time. Like, just because those, like, crawly things were awful and stuff. But I, I, had, I had a good time overall. I think it was good. So, yes, let's end the episode off here. Thank you all so much for watching. And I will see you then. Here we are. Thank you for coming. Bye. Bloop.